welcome my beautiful phantom audience to yet another rather <laughs> love by lady stream how's everybody doing today i hope you guys are excited as you have possibly seen um i do it is that time of year again <laughs> It is that time again. Hey, Misha! It's that magical, mystical time of the year. It's Loho Ho Fi. It is! Adore, Adore. <laughs> it's that mystical, magical time of the year again. You know, hello! I'm Elvira! Uh, as you may remember from last year, if you guys were around that time, uh, during that time, during this time of the year is when the um, the area, the spot from which I am broadcasting, passes through the center of the universe and lines me up perfectly with the legendary center hat. The center hat that is at the center of the universe, and it graciously allows me to wear it for a whole indeterminate amount of time until, Chris until Christmas ends. <laughs> and so I'm wearing it! With its permission. How's everybody doing today? Excess, hello! Good, 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 good. Good to hear. Glad you've been having a calm day. <clears throat> I've been having some issues. I, uh, oh, sorry. Uh, a couple days ago, I, I don't know what I did. I must have slept really badly, but um, I think I like pinched a muscle in my neck or something and I legitimately am in so much pain. <laughs> it's doing a lot better today. Um, it's still kind of twingy, but um, I'm feeling a lot better today. Thankfully, I got some sleep and it seems to have um, helped it heal a little. Good. I'm glad you're in a good mood. I am also in a good mood. I've been just laughing so much these last few days. Just another stream. Yeah, that's great. Oh, real quick. I was thinking actually what would be fun is if we, um, I was thinking it might be fun to actually like look through my recap a little bit because I wanted to show you guys some of it. I did post the, um, I post the, there it is. I posted like the the summary of it on um on the Discord, but um let's see. I guess there's not much to Yeah, I guess there's not that much to share cuz anything would be Okay, there is one thing in particular I've wanted to share with you guys, which I thought was weird. I need somebody's opinion on this because I don't really know. I tried looking up what exactly they mean by this. Hold on. Let me pull. Let me pull this window up. Okay, so... Let me pull this. Let me show. I, I want I want you guys. I want to figure out what this means, because there's no way this is actually like what it sounds like. OK, so. Huh? OK, so here this is my categories. This is the my top five categories. Um, It's saying that I was. <laughs> oh! Hello, Corin. How are you doing? We're just kind of going over my Twitch recap real quick. My top stream was 26 viewers. As I posted in the Discord, I have uh, I've had 10,000 hours watched across my whole streams. 377 streams, 337. Yeah, 377 streams over 365 days is pretty impressive. I do, if I do say so myself. Um. It's the dark times. That's what did it. Um, let's see. So yeah, what does this top ten percent mean? Because like that doesn't this doesn't make any sense for to be like I see them. I keep seeing them in lots of places. 
I, I don't understand. W top 10% of what? Like, top 10% view counts? Or... Or or what? I don't know. Whatever. Um, but yeah, I guess I was just wanted to share a little bit of that. I uh, a hundred and ninety thousand chats nearly. You guys are all lovely. Thank you for so talking so much in my chat. Um, I'm a little confused how my top five categories this year were. Tears of the Kingdom, followed by. Shmups, Toe Project, and Celeste. When I mean, you're streaming in goat category. Yeah, goat cat. Why is goat category here? <laughs> yeah, I love the goat streams too. I'm really confused. I'm really confused as to how Tears of the Kingdom was one of my top categories. Cause like I guess no yeah. No no she's like, yeah, yeah. That's why. <laughs> Uh, I guess last year was when we did the was when I did a whole lot of noise. Have I not had any like long running series this year? It's been a whole year. We had potionomics. We had okay. Hold on. Let me check my channel real quick. Playlists. Recent playlists. Uh, let's see. How many? How many? Oh my god, I did 15 Tears of the Kingdom streams? There's no way! There's no way! Oh my god, how did I do 15 Tears of the Kingdom streams? Well, I guess that would make it one of my top categories. I do not remember that. Oh yeah, it's awesome. It's a it's a great game. You should super play it. Potionomics is such a great game. Um mm -hmm. super worth the time to play it. So and then yeah, and of course my emotes. Um, um yeah, my emotes I guess these were the top used emotes were like um I guess Majimu. I don't know if this I I'm pretty sure this is not me. This is you guys. So I guess Majimu won. I'm really shocked, actually. I get. I didn't have. I'm guessing I didn't have Miss Miracle in long enough to for him to get top place. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Shining Force Neo should be. Yeah, it should. Wait, did I do the Shining? Did I do SFN this year? Was that yeah? SFN was this year, wasn't it? Or was it last year? Uh, June, yeah. It was last updated in June. Yeah! What the heck? Wait a minute. I had 19 SFN videos. What? People just love the door more than Smeargle. I guess they do. I guess they do. Not even stretch. All right, all right, all right. I'll stretch. I'll stretch. Let's get up, everybody. Up off your seats. Stretch your fingers up to the ceiling, dig your toes down to the floor. Oh, I think this will actually help a little bit. Yeah. Mm, stretch yourself all around. Twist and turn. Get yourself all limbered up. Ready for a long, incredible day of cassette boosts. Go ahead and slowly bend down and touch your toes. Ooh. Yeah, that felt good. Feel, just feel those quads and uh, calves and hamstrings opening up. Whew. Oh, it's got, they're animated. I somehow didn't notice that. I'm animated. Ver flip me. Ah, you noticed that, did you? I'm surprised you saw that that quickly. Yeah, while the center hat is gracing our presence, I have disabled the flip me emote. Or, uh, not emote. The Flip Me Redeem. That is a byproduct of la introducing channel points. I'm well aware of how my channel points work. Thank you. They're called almonds. Um, I had to, unfortunately, I had to disable Flip Me uh, last year thanks to the center hat because it's too tricky with the, with everything. Love doesn't want hat beard. I don't want hat beard. No, I don't.
And oh yeah, and so apparently this was my most watched clip. You know what's so funny? Before the re before this recap, it had 25 views. So it actually managed to get 16 more views thanks to you guys checking it out. And I really appreciate that. This is actually one of my favorite clips. We can watch it. Yeah, let's let's watch it real quick because it actually is actually one of my favorite clips that we've seen. Oh, wrong window. That was weird. Do, 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 do. And you guys will get to see Dobo Lofi. Lofi. No, it's you trying to kill me! How could you, me? Be What's funny? Yeah. The greatest organism ever to live! I'm so cool! And you? You're nothing but slime under my foot! But not to worry. I have a laser sword, and you do- Oh wait, actually you do have a laser sword, my bad. I mean, I have a bigger laser sword, which makes me better than you! You're cringe, vermin! <laughs> I love it! Ah, that was such a fun moment. I find myself quoting that all the time. Alright. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> thank you! Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> the cringe vermin. Yeah, the cringe vermin is like the best part. That's the part I've, I const I find myself constantly referencing that. Hmm. There we go. Let's see. Yeah, I love- I Yo, cringe vermin! Let's see. And I don't know what this means. I got two achievements and they won't tell me what they are. Um, <clears throat> no idea what that means. You guys have spent two and a half million channel points. You guys are wonderful. Thank you so much for the engagement. I have... I thought that said 130. Apparently I've acquired 131 new followers. You made us... I did. I did make you do 2.5 more billion. I spent more if you had more. No worries, Corin. Or no, I see what you mean. No, I know what you mean. Yeah! More, 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 more! We got 131 new followers, 20 new subscribers, 15 gifted subscriptions, two, two whole hype dreams! Uh-oh. Stream explosion. How fitting. Okay, there we go. We're back. No worries. No worries. We're back. We're nice and back. Go ahead and refresh. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know why it says all, but I guess this is supposed to be like, uh, like kind of just, a um, like a metaphor, like a little cute thing and played all kinds of co-op. 22 raids and two shout outs. I love, I love people. Everybody is so nice to me. My loudest fans, um, just a shout out to nine incredible people. If you're not on the list, that's fine. You're still the greatest person ever. <laughs> and yeah, thank you for playing, I guess. Don't forget to stream your recap. Cool. So thank you everybody for making this year an absolutely fantastic year. I really appreciate um. I really appreciate everything. Good see. Hey, Vorb. How's it going? Oh, I didn't know you could get a badge. Twitch recap. Oh, no. No worries. Um. 
No worries at all. Um, it was just a quick, yeah, it was just a quick run through of everything. Obviously, my top three tags are the ones I use all the time. This is my top five categories. You can check real quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And this is the this is the rundown I posted on Discord. So yeah. Uh, that's that's me. That's my recap. All right. Fun, fun, fun. Oof. Still waking up a little bit. I didn't really prepare for that. I probably should have prepared for that a little bit more. It's just like, hey guys, look at all the owl. Okay, hold on. I gotta go grab. I gotta go grab a napkin. I'll be right back. Hey guys, look how amazing I am. No, <coughs> it's like how amazing you guys are. The whole point of it, I guess that's, yeah, I guess that's a good point. The whole point of it was look how amazing you guys are. I'd like, it's so, like you guys, you guys have contributed so much to my stream. Watched me, chatted at me, flipped me. It's been great. Thanks for all the streams helping get your devil numbers. Yeah, me too. Me too. I hope we can double everything. Oh. Hold on. Okay. There we go. Just had to take care of something real quick. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. Brofi, thank you for the omen contribution to the wheel stream. How are you doing today? Speaking of flipping, nope. Bob, thank you for the omen contribution to the wheel stream. Megabee as well, thank you for the omen contribution to the wheel stream. You shall do it? Whoa, 50%. Excess and one other. Is that ether? Is ether hidden in there again? I did steal your flip power. You were not allowed. You're not allowed to flip me during center hat week or during the center hat period. Sorry. It caused too many problems last year. So excess one other. I'm sorry. It doesn't tell me who that is. You let me know if if, if that was you. Uh, Yuna and Corin, thank you for the omen contribution to the wheel stream. You guys are wonderful. Oh my god. We only have 40. <laughs> Jesus. We only have 40,000 left to go. Or 50. 50,000 left to go. We're. Whoa, we're halfway there. It's actually a user called one other. That actually would be kind of interesting. Is this the normal menu music? Misha is winning? Contributed 10,000. Wow, Misha is winning! I always win. <laughs> and is not competitive at all. Me, yeah, Misha, I think it's normal. Okay, cool. Thanks, Borb. All right, let's jump in. Wait, what? I'm serious. I'm serious, Yayanta. The latest batch of ranger trainees just don't have what it takes. They don't understand that strategy matters more than just transforming into the scariest monster. Well... Well, isn't that your job? To teach them? The newcomers are enthusiastic, and that's a good start. Who better than to teach them combat tactics than a master tactician? Huh. huh. I see your point. I'll reserve my judgment. Yeah. For now. Oh, sure, I'll do my best. I'll do my best to keep an eye on your behavior, dear Misha. Dang it, I 
lost it a little bit. So I spent all my shards apparently. All right. Ta -ta. Ta -ta. Bye, Ranger Wilma. All right. So here's the thing. Do I have it like turned up super? I do. I have it turned up super high. Oh, I don't usually have it this high while I'm streaming. I didn't realize that. Okay. So here's the deal. Um, if we look at our quests, uh, let's see. So I only have two people left to fight. Ah, uh, four of your divan. Big hugs. So let's see. I have, <laughs> I have two two gym leaders. What are they called? Captains. I have two captains remaining, and if I remember correctly, we know where they are. No, we don't. I took out the ones that I know. Hmm. Maybe if I look around, I'll get some hints. Can't remember the game at all. No worries. Only the music so far. Peak gameplay. Yeah, it's um. No worries. I'll get you. Perfect, thank you. I know what you're thinking. It'd be much easier to get around if I could climb vertical surfaces like pumpkin vines do. <gasps> it's the piney to get a jumpkin. I spent years pondering here, pondering this very subject too, but the only way either of us is going to find out if it's possible is if one of us records a pumpkin. I don't even know where to go. Because I love the limited 3D they use for this game. So charming. Well, before we go and get hints from the cafe, I'm just going to straight up go to the hugs. Ah, I'm going to go get a jumpkin. It's a cute pumpkin. Spread your skelly jelly on it. Of course, we're going to make an undead pumpkin. Oh, oh, hi, jumpkin. It's a cluck Billy. God, I love I love um, Ralph. That's right. She's so cool. Jumpkin! Yeah, it's this game. It's the Transforming Cassette Monsters game. I did not realize this game came out this year, actually. I thought this was an older game. I'm, I'm actually... I, I was... Um, the little fella's been on my me. Aw, for your status, crew, fun! Sorry, did they say Skeleton Jelly? They did. It was Skelly Jelly. No, no, no. It was Skelly Jelly. You get skelly jelly from that one of those poison people. The the big poison blob people that I was really hoping would evolve and didn't. <laughs> yeah, it's just called um it's just marrow, yeah. Skelly jelly. <laughs> Skeleton jelly. So let's see. Uh, not a great matchup for because I just need to remove Cluckability as fast as possible. All right, transform. We're gonna peekaboo the whole team. Transform. Characters are holding cassettes from just glancing. I thought they were holding rifles. Oh, yep. Nope. They're holding. Um. Yeah. They're <laughs> they're holding cassette decks. Dang. That's fine. I got conducted. All right, we're gonna use. We're gonna use Thunder Blast because um, that'll actually get us a bonus, uh, a bonus on Jumpkin. All right. Although now that I think about it, Jumpkin's only level 38, so I might want to be careful. I'm gonna dodge with Kaylee. I am pumpkin jelly? Hmm. I am skelly jelly? No, I don't know if you're skelly jelly. Yeah, I'm level 46. They're only level 38. So, like. Oh! No! No, 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 no! Thank God! Oh. That was so close. No! I hit the wrong button, it's pin bell! <laughs> pin bell is actually like the best name ever. Um, that's incredible. Pin bell is like actually funny. Like some of these, they're just, you just smush the moon, the names together and they don't actually fit. 
But Pinbell is actually like a Pokemon name. It's a pun, I should say, at the very least. Nurse. We Pinbell. <laughs> <laughs> no pumpkin pie oh that's so cute you get to see jump can eat a little pumpkin pie okay pun yeah there we go i'm gonna defuse i'm gonna use i don't really want to waste a tree bark tape let's use just use a chrome tape and we'll use inflame mm, inflame might actually be a bad idea let's use um let's use spit instead i guess Recording! God. Uprooted. There it is. 100% chance. Yay! I got the pumpkin vine ball ability. Jumpkin! Jumpkins are created when they eat jelly from a jelly tin and smeared onto a regular pumpkin, giving it sentience. The Jumpkin is a curious and friendly being that seems to never stop moving. Oh, buddy, buddy. What do we need, ma'am? Um. I know! Look at his little Springus! Because of his little... Because of his little curly Q arms and legs and how he's always jumping around. Spring. Look at Springus. What do you guys think? Is that an okay name? Sure. Perfect. <laughs> it's not offensive in any way, because I'm not just a little rambunctious spring guess perfect. Just a little rambunctious spring guess. Hey lizard, how's it going? Hi, Ether! Hello, Ether! Welcome to the stream! How you doing today? I love that emote. That's your... Yeah, that... Ooh! Wow, they really changed... Wow, they changed a lot of things about... About chat, huh? The untin... Oh, speaking of... Um... The unhappy salmon. Oh! Uh, speaking of, by the way... Um... I actually had to go in and completely delete all of my, um, well, not all. So, like, I fixed the chat thing, you know, from Sunday? Chat changes, yeah, I don't know. I don't know why. But now when you hover over an emote, it actually tells you the name of the emote and the channel that created it. But, um, but anyway, um, I figured out what how. Well, I didn't figure out what happened, but I figured out how to fix the chat problem from Sunday. I actually had to go in, and then we've. Oh, has it? Huh. I'm only just now seeing it. Just planning which animation reel I'm going to be doing next. Currently, fine. Hmm. I hadn't. I didn't realize. Maybe we were being A-B tested! <gasps> Maybe! He's clicking on it, show the creator. Oh, really? Okay. But, uh, what I had to do was... Yay! Spacey! Spacey Bat! Aww! See, I never got to see the channel name. I guess if I... I never clicked on them. But yeah, um... If you... What I had to do was I had to go into my OBS, like, folder in my computer and delete OBS browser, like, the folder OBS browser. It was a big folder. I had to delete it. I had to get rid of all my chat, all of my chat browser sources, delete my OBS browser, restart OBS, and then it would work. So we're gonna be done some fun! I had to delete an entire massive folder so that they, basically, it would reinitialize my browser sources. So frustrating. All right, we got ourselves a jumpkin. I wasn't. Uh, the the hardest work. You cannot hold LB to climb up walls using sticky vines. Oh. Uh, it wasn't that much work. The 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 hardest part was 
was figuring out the answer because there was only like one there was only one answer from like 2021 um there was only one person who had like any any um any assistance at all it was from an old old 20 oh, an old form in like 2021 old just kidding but like it was from a previous version of obs because as i mentioned before i have to use an old version of obs uh oh choo choo <laughs> choke 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 boom <laughs> oh my god I'm just a giant vine ball. Oh. I'm gonna keep putting writing progress in our Yeah, of course not. I don't mind. But yeah, thanks, Lizard. Yeah, it was it was just a uh, one day hard. Mm -hmm. crops. Wow, I'm all over the place today. Whew. I'm feeling kind of jumpy. <laughs> Nobody, because I took this power with my ooh! I took this power with my own two hands. What? Huh? So you can you can only go so you can only go so high. Interesting. Okay. Spider loaf, spider loaf. It is good catch. I made it a little bigger because it was hard for me. It it looked it looked too small. Would you guys like me to change it back? Because I can if you'd like. A friend of mine told me he heard deep, mad, and cackling from one of the graves in the graveyard west of the creek. Weird, huh? Cackling. Deep, manic cackling. Wait a minute. Lost Hearts Graveyard. We've been over there before. Oh, the abandoned mine! That's right. The abandoned mine was, uh, was like DLC, you guys said. Free DLC. I don't have a I don't have a train station around here yet. You can read now, yay! That's exactly what I was wanting. Perfect. Hmm. <sighs> nope. Yay! Oh my god, I'm so powerful. I have vine ball powers. Hmm. I'll challenge this rogue fusion, sure. Oh, a carnahiel. I don't remember. Oh, I guess we'll use uh, burn then. Superheated fists. Ow! Oh, absorbs. The grass absorbs the poison. Ah, oh, okay. Grass is weak to po- What? Oh, we are doing so much damage. I do! I do have the spike ball from Bowser's Inside Story! I do! Oh my god, you're right! I hadn't even thought of that, but it's not just like soft sand walls, it's literally everything. I always was extremely fascinated with how they actually put the little puncture holes in the wall when you use that move. Um, I absolutely loved that they did that. I was just like, oh, it's such attention to detail. No. Uh, 
stab the wall. Mm-hmm. 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 That's exactly it. Transform! Oh, I want four. No. I was like, since it's multi target, I wonder if it hits the. Uh. That's what we spike ball. When you think about it, how does he do that? He curls up! He curls up! His, stre his shell is stretchy. We're gonna use about uh charge. He's very flexible! You're right, that's exactly it! That's actually the in-game explanation! That's so clever, Borb. I completely forgot that was the in-game explanation. What's Brace for Impact? Hits one target, uses the user's melee defense stat instead of melee attack, also damages the user. It is a metal? It's a metal move? Yeah, I Bastards Inside Story was such a weird experience for me because like I really I really liked it. Like I love it a lot. Because um there's something there's something about Like I like I am definitely not claustrophobic. In fact, um I guess as long as I can breathe, I like small tight spaces. So the and small like cozy small tight spaces. So there's something about there was something about like journeying throughout Bowser's body that was just like oh that was just like I really like this it's like it felt it felt all cozy even though it was supposed to be like technically it was all gross because it's like oh it's inside body it's like bodily function but I, they didn't make it gross which I really liked thing chippy there's a sort of rhythm game in it is there really I didn't remember that there's sort of a rhythm game in uh, Superstar Saga Bonjour. as well. Bonjour, Clemence. Comment ça va? Let's see. Uh... <laughs> ah, dang it. Yeah, I, I keep hearing that too. <laughs> I was really worried the first time I heard it. I'm like, oh, no ship. Okay. But to be... Au revoir. Au revoir, Clemence. Unfortunately, it does fit. We are in a bit of a pickle. Red and green spark. Red and green sparks back. Oh, is that one of the items? Is that one of the bros items? Basically, Taiko no Tatsujin. Ah. Hmm. Do you think New World can physically change us? When we arrive, I mean. It's difficult for me to put it into words. My body in New World is not the same as it was in my previous life. It's like this is how I appear in my own dreams, like how I picture myself. Not exactly the same. I don't know what will happen when I go back, either. Oh. That's something I feel like we should have been talking about earlier. What? Like a surreal dreams? They were! I really liked it. It was like a surreal dreamscape, and I, there was something really, really, like, comforting about the fact where, like, Mario and Luigi are inside, are, are, are in this whole big world, but... It's just Bowser. And as Bowser, you can walk around and technically they're moving throughout the world while they're actually just inside Bowser. It's so cool. Oh God, the nine, don't even remind me of the, about the 99 block challenge. I think I inhaled my own saliva. Excuse me for a moment. I did. 
I was told, oh, thank you, Corin. I'll try my best. I've been trying my best for a long time now. Sure. Good idea. Hi, Dre Redeem. Thanks, Corin. Let's see. <laughs> Yeah, I got killed by the 99 block. It heard me talking trash and was like, mm -mm 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 -mm. this girl going down. <gasps> well, I'm thinking that the Rangers would benefit from some physical fitness classes. <laughs> we could even make it fun. How about dance aerobics? Sybil could provide a music playlist. Yeah, yeah, that sounds like a cute idea. If you think you can manage it, of course. No sweat. No sweat. I used to run a cardio class every week for five years. If anyone's up to the job, it's me. Yeah, she looks like she runs a cardio class. That's not enough. Fans. I just mean she's like literally wearing the, the like jazzercise aerobics like outfit like uh, uniform. Yeah, I love I love Buffy. She's so cool. Did I succeed? Of course not. <laughs> of course not. I got utterly trashed by the um. I got utterly trashed by the um by the 99 block challenge. Also, that was like the weakest rogue, rogue fusion we've ever stumbled upon. I guess it wasn't really weak if... It, it wouldn't have been weak if I hadn't been so high level. We also controlled Bowser's what made that work so well. There's lots of stories with the incredible journey angle, but having both sets of characters having such a focus in BIS was super clear. It was. It was. And like, and that's what I really loved. I really loved uh, the, the them technically working together. I liked that so much. It, it was just... It was done so well. It's one of my favorite. I, I was real. I I really loved that game. And fortunately, I really I really dig the. Mm, I really dig the um. Like the hand drawn, the two D animation. So, I was really excited for a reboot. But when I learned that they were doing three D animation, I was a little like it looks fine, but I'm I was a little disappointed because I much prefer the 2D animation to the 3D animation, honestly. I'm glad it got a remake. I'm glad it got a, it got bumped up into the... Uh, higher up into the... Um, into the zeitgeist so people... so new people can find it. I'm just a little sad that it... Um, that it ended up being 3D instead of 2D. That a bit punchy someone... Oh, it felt so good! You are so right. It felt so good. Landing that punch properly had so much power to it. Like, having him reel, reel back for, like, with, like, four separate stages of prepping for a punch, and then BAM! When you hit him and they get knocked back, like, a good, like, 50 feet and have to walk back to their position? Mmm. Satisfying. Whoa. Made you actually feel like a boss monster. It was so fun. Number was, was in a very punching <laughs> impact. I didn't know what he was lost a dog. I saw one running around with a tape recorder. It's an ordinary dog, not a pom bomb. At the foot of Mount Weirrell, near the corner of the lake. It's a transforming dog! I do hope the poor thing is okay. It's... Oh! Well, now we gotta go find that thing. Or that little guy. Yeah, that too! Just in those remakes. I think they should have waited another generation, personally, but I guess it really needed the two screens to work. I guess so. Level 40 Bowser equals final boss. Oh, I guess he does a final boss rank. <gasps> that reminds me of the... Ugh. Um, the... Oh my god, the, the clothing stores? I, like, I know this is silly, but it made me feel so special. Like, like when when you get to, when you get the, the higher ranks, like Mushroom, Flower, and you get access to the bigger stores, and then you hit the star rank, and they're like, Welcome, dear sirs, come get a foot massage. I'm like, oh, I'm special. <laughs> Oh, extra boss rank. Ugh. Like, I know it sounds so silly, but like, going, getting, uh, getting better and better treatment and like better and better surrounding. That's what I really love. Is they wouldn't even like let. I don't even think they would let you into the stores if you weren't a high enough rank. And getting to go, um, getting to go in and see like the different. No, it's not real. They mean ah. <laughs> getting to see, um, getting to see the, um, the like the more the fancier and fancier stores it was just like really really cool i just like i like shopping okay i like really i like the cute i like 
um, general store aesthetic. I love general store aesthetic with like, uh, with like bottles of stuff and like little, then those little like angular trays with like the, the high backs and, and like shelves of colorful bottles and items and like bags of things and, and like big and like big shelves in the middle and everything's so cluttered and, and there are like little, little like cabinet, like fridge cabinets with like stuff in them too. I love the general store aesthetic. All the papers we got a scoop. Girl like shopping. <laughs> But it's not just clothes shopping. I even like grocery shopping. Grocery shopping is so fun. What the result anymore? I feel like you're messing with Dave States while the <laughs> Dave States. <laughs> Quit messing with Dave. He didn't deserve it. With the scratch cards after buying items, I don't remember the result anymore. Testing if the card was rigged or not. I don't remember. I think I, I remember trying that too. I remember trying that too, or at least trying to do something along those lines. Dave. <laughs> Dave! Oh my god. Did I find a bunch of new, um... Greetings! Greetings, Lovi! How many different species have you recorded? 58? Not bad, not bad! Come chat, me, chat with me again when you reach 60. Don't forget to remaster your tapes when they reach 5 stars. I've heard of a handful of species that can only be obtained that way. Plant a sapling? Sure. I'll plant the... Lavenders. La Dave dates. <laughs> Dave dates. <laughs> I love that when uh, when your partner gets trapped, they just sort of they just sort of like fly up and around the obstacle. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. Let's go get captain advice from the from the gramophone cafe. There isn't any right now. All right, so it's a Geki Town again. Uh, I don't remember. Oh, 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 oh! Here, that's where we are. I knew that sounded familiar, but I couldn't remember why. That's a Gekki Town! That's a Yeah, we did! Let's see. Mm. 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 Oh, there it is! Yeah, we found it! Let's see, so we actually have most of the map now, which I'm very happy about. It means we might be nearing the end of the game. Might be. We very well also might not be. Um, let's take care of some of the land keepers. Now that we have the vine ball, um, now we have the vine ball, we, um, we can get to a lot of different places that we didn't, weren't able to before. Well, I say we weren't able to, it's that just, we just weren't. Oh, that was interesting. And we weren't going because I could still use the cube. Remember, I could still use the cube. All right. Fig me! Still a trainee after all this. Yep. New world. What experience such growth with a regulated housing market in place? There's no need to fight progress. There is, actually. Level 44. Ooh, Kingrave and Scampire. Ooh. He runs between trainee and not trainee. No, because um. Well, I guess I guess that does make sense, but no, it kind of makes sense because like the the idea is that this is my this is my initiation ritual. Like this is my this is my the test I need to pass to become an actual member of the uh, the Rangers. If I remember, Kingrave is a um, melee attacker. I'm gonna hit him with peekaboo as well. Uh oh, energy shot is pretty strong. <clears throat> Wing. I 
I do not remember how, uh, what, what is good against Earths, because we don't see very many Earths. Astral. Okay, so astral, metal, plant, and water. <gasps> right! I have a better idea. I'm switching to Shoku. And I'm using Deja Vu on myself. No! Um, hold on. We're gonna use Smack to get rid of that wall. And then we're going to... We're gonna peekaboo them again. Watch this, this is gonna be amazing. Bloody long initiation, yep. I was thinking burn the earth. That was my first, in my first, my initial reaction. All right, so check this out. No, oh wait, I can still do it. Ish bash bosh, I don't care. Cause you're gonna miss, yay. All right, here we go. We're gonna use um, Thunder Blast and Spit. I believe um, Lo-Fi should be faster than Kaylee in, these, in this form. Here we go, Thunder Blast. The lightning turns him into glass. The air resonates him. And then Spit, which resonates. And then double Spit since I am multi-strike. Instant kill! Ha <laughs> ha Wait, did that just kill with damage? Man. <laughs> the strategy, yes! What? Wait, they have more Queenix and Riptera. Let's do it again. Uh oh, I'm petrified. Um. No, I'm not petrified. Wait, I am? I thought I could only use defensive moves. Ten turns of blind. Just a little bit over. Yeah, just a little bit. Just a little bit. No worries. Uh, I'm switching to Spoofy. Oh, not Gambit! Um, oh no, I'm enraged. Uh, I think it's over. I think it's over, you guys. I can't! It's weird! Delegate. Plastic knife? Yep, that's death. We need to get rid of Queen X. Okay, sure would like to be unpetrified. What happens if I fuse? Like, I have so many negative status effects. <laughs> An awful plastic knife. Strategic thinking, thank you! Here we go, Thunder Blast. The lightning turns him into glass. The air resonates him. And then... Spit. Which resonates. And then double spit since I am multi-strike! Instant kill! Ha 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 ha! Wait, did that just kill with damage? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for leaving that part in. I really appreciate that. The Riptera has 15 turns of blind. They did do. I need to look away from Medusa. I'm trying. It's not working. I need to switch off of Shoku into, like, Mega Violence. 
Uh, switch back to Decibel. Oh, shrapnel! Wait. Oh my god, that plastic knife does so much. No, don't gambit yourself, too! Jesus! Uh-oh. I'm gonna Toxic Stab Queenix. I'm gonna peekaboo the Queenix. No! Mm. No! Jesus! Kaylee's nearly dead! Oh my god, Gambit is so dangerous. Alright, Funerine it is. Um... If I sticky spray the Queenix. Okay. Um, it's everyone in the battlefield except the user. All right, we're going for it. Fusion! The fighting Kaylee's hearts act as one! Love to test! Oh, her face! Waterworks! Uh-oh. I'm frozen, and I flinched. Oh my god. Jesus, that does so much damage! Gambit is, like, so annoying. Ooh, I like this song, too. I'm blue! Them. We crushed them! Right! Right! Eugene, what we happen here, we sent these clowns packing. Give me that. Found a fused material. Um. Did they just self that they did? I don't fuse enough. No, I do! <laughs> nah, I mean, I guess I could... I mean, I fuse pretty much as much as I'm allowed to. Wait! I knew what that was. <laughs> yeah, their gambits ran out of turn. Pure skill, yep. How it works is that uh, when you use gambit, your, um, you, when you afflict yourself with the gambit status effect, it dramatically increases all of your stats, like to a ridiculous level. But when the gambit status runs out, you die. So, um, um, so it's just like a last ditch. It's like a last ditch, uh, push to be your opponents. I need to get some healing. Let's just leave. All right, so. No! If you're looking for an investment that will stand the test of time, try a clock. I mean, a parcel of land. Oh no, stand the time. I just noticed the cassettes don't have just one, but two of my pain pal. Oh, they do. I guess it is a pretty etherish skill, isn't it? Um, yeah, that's what I thought. Wink. Oh, I can't do torrent yet. Hold on. Um. Full story. Uh, 
heroic point. Royal time! Choing, choing, choing! Nice, seated. Alright, so now we're healing. No worry, Sandstorm it doesn't work like it do in Pokemon. Nice. Oh, they have a little cracking sanding cry. That's cute. I really wish Sands of Time stayed the way it does. Like, or they look similar. Uses that hourglass shape. Oh. <laughs> Sands of Time's evolution space. Time is all the same. Uh, this is what Sands of Time evolves into, or remasters into, I should say. In case anybody's curious, what that incredibly cool idea of a, a an hourglass is broken and creates like a like a dress like a dress look evolves into this. So we've got like the bowler hat. Uh, we've got the, the like, dress-looking bits of sand. We've got the big claw. So, um, naturally, it'll evolve, definitely remaster into this. Um, a giant bruiser juggernaut berserker with a gas mask and shards of glass stuck in its back. So, yeah. <laughs> also, where did it get the other, where did it get the other half of the hourglass for its other hand? It didn't have that originally. <laughs> Angie. <laughs> like it's an okay design. It's an it's a neat it's an oh it's a it's a well enough design, but I really would have liked something a little different for 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 uh, Sands of Time's remaster. Let's see. Well, because it's very it's very all or nothing explosive. You and Kaylee discuss fond memories of places you visited as children. Mm. Mm. Sorry, Ether. Yeah, it's just that uh, Misha was saying that um, that Gambit feels like a very Ether kind of skill just because it seems like the kind of extremely risky, daring strategy you would like to use just from what we know about you, just from what I know about you. Obviously, I don't know everything about you, but that definitely fits with what I know of your personality. Hopefully, that's not offensive, because I did not mean it to be. I love the way the subway gates open. I suppose so? Okay. If it's not, you can correct us. That's totally allowed. Let's see. I would really like to find that lost dog, but, um... I also want to kind of try to find Viola's brother, Sebastian. Tell my sister she is to meet me here. What? He's a ghost? Was that Viola's brother? We should tell her. Oh no! So, so he's a ghost. What happened? Oh, he was an undying trap. Rude. I just go with the more straightforward self-destruction explosion. Yeah, okay, fair enough. I guess it is a little, it's not quite as straightforward as it could be, huh? We're gonna double peekaboo. <clears throat> Gets ambushed rude. Yeah, exactly. It is rude. <laughs> Spit. Let's see. 
<laughs> it's not polite to sneak up on your opponents and stab them in the back. It's just not, it's just not proper etiquette. Listen, if you want to fit in with high society, you're going to need to learn to be a lady. So in order to do that, you're going to need to learn how to properly and politely ambush your foes. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to lay out. Yes, exactly. What you're going to do is you're going to lay out a, you are going to lay out a trap. Now, don't, don't be wrong. Don't get me wrong about that. You are going to lay out a trap, but this trap will simply trigger a sign that pops up and says, hello, tis I, your sworn enemy. And then you rappel down from the trees. You're in the forest. You're always in the forest. You rappel down from the trees, land in front of the sign and go, ha ha ha, I shall now kill you. And they won't do anything because you have properly announced your presence. It's all, oh, that is poli a polite way to get ambushed. So a polite way to get ambushed properly, if your opponent has properly ambushed you, the polite way is to simply allow them to walk up and stab you in the face. Now that is true etiquette. <laughs> See, Bonhoeff and Zolt took this course to make sure someone is going to die before they don't die. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Ah. That is the polite way to kill somebody. Is to strap them to a table and and uh, have a laser that is slowly approaching their face. That way it gives them proper time to escape, even though they definitely won't escape. They'll never escape. They never do. So, uh, that's, that's the idea. Also, don't look up that statistic. They never escape. <laughs> politely leave us to not witness it. Exactly. Politely leave so as not to witness their gruesome demise. It has a dual purpose, in fact. Uh, leaving so as to not witness their witness their gory, horrible demise, but also, um, just pull out a shine and dislodge their blood. <laughs> Ew. No, 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 that's far too personal. It's far too personal. We are sophisticated, high society people, Ether. We must do it the proper way. Hands off. It, uh, oh, by the way, the laser does serve a double meaning. As I was a uh, double a double function. I was as, as I was saying, you do not need to witness their bloody demise, but also, also, again, it gives them that chance to escape, even though they definitely won't. Giving them a proper chance to escape uh, without without being in view of you is just polite. Ambush etiquette. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Corin. Listen, if you want to fit in with high society, you're going to need to learn to be a lady. <laughs> Someone with courtesy and or manners? I am going to do that. You're going to need to learn how to properly and politely ambush your foes. Now, what you're going to do is you're going to lay out... Yes, exactly. What you're going to do is you're going to lay out... A, you are going to lay out a trap. Now, don't don't be wrong. Don't get me wrong about that. You are going to lay out a trap, but this trap will simply trigger a sign that pops up and says, "Hello, tis I, your sworn enemy." And then you rappel down from the trees. You're in the forest. You're always in the forest. You rappel down from the trees, land in front of the sign, and go, "Ha ha ha! I shall now kill you." And they won't do anything because you have properly announced your presence. It's all oh, that is poli a polite way to get ambushed. So a polite way to get ambushed properly, if your opponent has properly ambushed you, the polite way is to simply allow them to walk up and stab you in the face. <laughs> I love it. Should I curse you when ambushing somebody? Of course. That adds in another level of elegance and beauty, obviously. Yes, and draw a weapon from your hidden pockets, of course, because your dress has pockets. You're sophisticated. If you're a fancy lady, your dress is going to have very well hidden pockets. Let's see. Hmm. Okay, so let's head back here. Thank 
Thank you for taking lo-fi lo -fi ladies battle etiquette class. That'll be $4,000. <laughs> Let's see. Hey, uh, Viola? What? What's that? You saw a vision of my brother? You must tell me more! You just have throwing mm. knives hidden. As soon as you're done with the formalities, you flick your wrist and they won't have enough time to respond to the pointy metal flechette going towards them. Mm. Flechette? I shall be sending you the first payment show. Yay! <laughs> Corin, thank you for the omen contribute. No, you didn't! <laughs> The, the sacred bowl of oatmeal is a peas. Thank you. This is the most, the 4,000, it's most of it. Yeah, it's pretty close. Close enough. Channel points have a one-to-one -one conversion rate to dollar. Of course they do. Yeah, yeah. Every channel point is worth one human dollar. Yep. Every almond. Every almond is worth one human dollar. I see. My brother may still be among the living, but perhaps only his soul instead lingers. I must know for sure. Lo-fi, if it is not too great a task, could you take me to the place you saw him? Sure. Let us travel with haste. You can rest your worries. The road will offer little danger with me at your side. Why did you specify human dollar? Uh, because that's the human currency? Right? Uh, yeah. U.S. and or Canadian dollar is what I meant to say. <clears throat> Which human dollar? One of them. You do not forget about cow dollars. Right, because cow dollars. <laughs> Thank you. That's definitely why I was distinguishing it. Oh, spirit. Right. Spirits are advanced mollusk-like mollusk -like creatures. Their major organs will reside in the shell head with its body being an extended set of limbs. Its movements are swift and elegant, and they often cloak themselves with seaweed for protection from the elements. Neat. Can send 4,000 Zimbabwe dollars. New Zealand dollars. We don't talk about New Zealand. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> love New Zealand. Big love to New Zealand. Ugh. Yeah, of course. They also count for New Zealand dollars. Mm-hmm. Kiwi dollars. Oh! Kiwi dollars. <laughs> Three different kiwis all in the same sentence. I love that picture. All right, so we're not renaming Spirouette because that is not mine. Kaylee's return to the Gramophone Cafe. Okay, sure. Everybody's looking for something. Travel with Viola to the Cast Iron Shore. Um, Spirouette's water. In that case, then, for now, since we're traveling with Viola, for now, I'm going to swap out Funerain with, um, why can't I rest? I guess I'm not going to be swapping out Funerain. No, 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 I know a Korok seed spot when I see it. Hmm. So what I thought it was, I didn't realize it was just gonna let me scale any wall at all. I thought it was gonna be specifically these vines. You may not sleep now. There are monsters nearby. Too true.
This is the place. Brother. My brother, if you are in this place, speak to me. <laughs> you just, no. Hmm. Let us search this place and then be rid of it. I like Viola. Her outfit's really cool. There's a stillness here that fills me with an unease. Do you not feel it? Let's pass quickly through this fog and filthy air. Ah! Hey! I did I literally just get done giving a whole class on a proper ambush tactics? Real sinking feeling about this one. It's no fair that I can't ever sleep. Neither can I, for I am the most wicked of them all. <laughs> I will park my bicycle in front of your door so you can never open it. <laughs> I'm so evil. <laughs> We use Sharpen. We're going to switch off of Viola because that's just not a good matchup. Or off of uh, Spirouette. Maybe blow. No, don't blow my bicycle. That's illegal. That's against the rules. Don't let it just blow up my bicycle. That's so mean. What? <gasps> the rest would be. Why didn't the TTS go through? The rest will be under a nearby truck by dawn. By the way, I love the limited 3D they use for this game. It's so charming. <laughs> love you, Borb. Water wall and metal. That's kind of like Wonder Wall, but not quite. I don't care the door will go with it. It's just a door that will be permanently open. Fair enough. Click. Some plastic, water coating, not really a big deal. What is that? Oh no! No 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 I see you. Excuse you No, we're not no, that's against the no. It's the principle of the matter. There's no parking sign on sign, so I can do whatever I want to your bike that clearly violates this sign. No, but, 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 no. <laughs> Be adorable. Knee slapper. Hey, hey, have we met? Wait. Oh, I legit thought you were a mannequin, sir. Hey, hey, have we met? Nope, I'm certain I remember a face like yours. Well, if you're looking for cheap goods, I'm your man, but I don't like to stick around in places for very long. Don't let my ma lack of a shirt discomfort you. I traded it to a young woman who gave it to a bear a while back. Let no one tell you I ain't dedicated to the cause of distribution. Take a look at my catalog, why don't you? Is that supposed to be a reference to something? Because I don't get it. Wood. Focus. Oh, I have to buy this stuff. Oh, I'll buy a toaster tape. I can buy toaster tapes? Yeah, I'll buy nine toaster tapes. Absolutely, sir. Um, wood? Oh, for two wheat. A thousand wood for two thousand wheat. Sure. Oh boy, the lack of money in these parts sure makes things difficult. Catch you later. Bye. Unfortunate is that my dear brother must find himself in such a place. Me, we, we, no! Oh! I really don't like these things. All right, choke you! Face is playing Catan. I'll trade two e for a wood. Ah, clever. Is it content? Okay, so, so, uh, poll time. Wait, hold on. Uh, I'm gonna start a poll because I want to know the answer to this. What do you guys think? Oh, I didn't mean to copy that. Well, I clipped it at that for some reason. Hold on.
Spanish poll. Here we go. I'm gonna do a new poll. Is it cut tan or Catan? Catan. I don't know how Paul hasn't been mentioned. Paul. Yes! Oh my god, it's been so long since Paul has been mentioned. <laughs> I cannot believe. I can't believe. It was so perfect. I can't believe Paul was like the strongest trainer in the whole game. This gym of mine, by the way. Let's see. Uh, cut on. Cut on. You know what? I never do this. I'm actually going to allow this. Hold on. It's five additional almonds per vote. <laughs> no, no, no. This one's, this one's silly. I'm not going to do that. Uh, five. We, we'll just do single votes only. Apparently it's Catan. Is that Catan? Catan. Cata. Noun. A disease you get from chewing too much. Split! It's neck and neck! Catan versus Catan! Who's gonna win? There's one vote for each! <laughs> High stakes! We'll see. It's gonna be like a five minute vote, so we'll see when it gets done. Alright. Whoa! I just dropped my controller. Damn, 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 damn. Alright, we'll go Heroic Blade on this one. We'll go battery on this one. Conductive is actually a really interesting status effect because it deals damage to you if an electric move is used, regardless of if you were the target or not. IPA? 10 or 10? Listen, I don't want to use IPA. I don't drink. Get it, waka waka. Get it? Let's see. All right, let's use heroic slice and charge. Heroic blades. Join, 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 join. I love their hissing noise they make when they leave. Okay, so quick smack is pretty low tier, but sure, why not? Come here. Oh. <gasps> Brother! I have waited many moons to meet you, Viola of Messaline. I have such delights to share with you. What? <laughs> That's not as you do not deceive me, spirit. I shall not play your games. No. But the night's festivities have not yet even begun! Come, Viola of Messaline. You shall find your family within, for I am your brother's keeper. Well... I spare little faith in the words of the spirit, but if it knows of Sebastian and my name, perhaps it speaks the truth. Hmm. Everybody's looking for something. Alright, looks like we're about to find ourselves an archangel. Fine ball. This vessel must have once been a sight to behold. Whoa. What was that? Did you guys see that? There was like a... Oh god, that was scary. Is it tan? Is it the English getting tanned or the Japanese suffix tan? Oh, yeah! I'll read your options without confusing it with all the other possible pronunciations. Ah! Yeah, those are the two options. Tan and tan. Shadows are coming for me. Oh, look, it's a vending machine. That's not a vending machine. I need to find a pump wheel. Kathoom! Oh my god, stop it! Stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it. Oh my god, I don't like this. 
God, this is like legitimately creepy. Where's the venting machine though? <laughs> Sus. I'm a goose. The spirit that spoke to me. What I could want, I dare not ask. Oh, it's a fountain. Uh, Fountess is usually, um... Fountess is usually... ranged attack. I'm gonna switch over to Shoku. This seems to be a heavily water-based area. I need to keep- I need to keep Viola as Shoku. I keep forgetting to do that. Spray! Wow, yeah, this is a good defense for a water type. You may have noticed a theme with this quest. I have! It's spooky, scary ghosts! Uh. Katon one! Yeah! Alright, it is it is official! Katan Katan is pronounced Katan. It was Katan is in Japanese suffix and Katon. Tom is Tom rhymes with yawn. Well, yeah. Well, we're this. This is English. We don't care that much about subtle nuances between so between vowels. <laughs> Let's see. It's a joke, by the way. I'll be taking that wheel. Thank you. <laughs> no. All right, let's go put the wheel in. Remove from inventory and valve hint. Uh... Okay. There goes all the water. The water is drained! Come, time is precious! Ah, there it is. Yep, it's a subway inside of a sunken ship, which doesn't make any sense, but okay. The Shoku. Yeah, I can't open that. Shut your yap with all those facts. Uh, <laughs> no, no, it's okay. It's just it's because I know you. If yeah, if you were some stranger, it would have been like, hey, but but it still sounds so goofy enough that I probably would have just been like, yar. <laughs> You can't tell me nothing, you yellow-bellied landlubber! How about you shove off and walk the plank? Yeah. Hell is a place for suffering, and English has made countless speakers suffer. Before English is hell, what are demonstrandum? Yep. Setting up franchises anywhere these days, right? <laughs> God! It's like... Hi, welcome to McDonald's. What can I get you? It's like we're we're at the bottom of the ocean. Welcome to McDonald's Mordor branch. What can I get you? Um Would you like to take try our Lego last Lego Lost meal? Lego last meal or our um our um well or, or our new quarter pounder or new quarter pounder deal this deal will be Aragorn before you know it! <laughs> curly fries! We don't sell curly fries here. Go to Arby's or some sort of other low-brow restaurant if you want curly fries. Please. This is McDonald's. We have standards here. <laughs> You're gonna throw it into the volcano? <laughs> yeah, buy our new... Uh, our new unhappy meal with comes with one free one ring as a happy meal toy. Visit our play play our play place of onion rings that ah. <laughs> okay, fine. We offer onion rings. Oh, 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 once you try one of our one of our onion rings, you're gonna be saying, Gimli some more! Uh, 
Okay. Waka waka. <laughs> So, uh, so Fro, don't forget to get as many, as much food as you possibly can. Because <laughs> th these deals will be Aragorn before you know it. I know we already did that one. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, these deals will be Elgond. Before you know it, Gondor. Ah, oh, no, that was not who's right there. These deals will be Gondor before g out the Gondor before you know it. <laughs> They're so awful. I love them. Dude, dude, dude. Stabbings are guaranteed to be 100% not entirely lethal. I would know. I deliver Lord of the Rings puns! It happens to me all the time! In the subtitle, tiny subject stabbings are not supplied with every unhappy meal. <laughs> I love it! In one lucky unhappy meal, you do in fact end up with a, um, what's the name of the... In every uh, in one out of every two hundred Happy Meals, find one free Morgul blade. That way you can you can stab your sibling and take their ring. <laughs> this is such a goofy like. <laughs> this is such a goofy world we've created. Oh my god. Uh, we're not good at plastic. I need to switch back to... What beats poison? Only fire. And plant is not good against it, so... Heading out night. See you later, Ether! Have a wonderful day! Yeah, dance and dino! And spacey bats! I love the Spacey Wiggle. Oh my god, I haven't seen Spacey Jam! Spacey Jam is so good! Also, for my chat, they blow up the, uh, the, the emote a lot bigger than they used to, so it's a lot easier to see what's going on with it. <laughs> yo, Abyo! How you doing? Have a good night, Ether! How you doing, Abyo? I'm gonna switch to Mega Violent, then. And then Decibel. I don't have Decibel! Um... Dang it! I'm gonna switch to Fenerine then. Even more violent? Even more violent than ever, baby! Also loves you are hereby exiled for celebrating Christmas more than one week early? Now Ethan. I'm not celebrating Christmas. I am welcoming the center hat into my home. You see, if you guys don't remember, the center hat has nothing to do with Christmas. This is the hat at the center of the universe. Once a year, my the the, the room where I broadcast from crosses through the center of the universe where the center hat is located and during that period of time the center hat has given me permission to wear it to put my head inside of it for streaming corporations be excited too god i wish <laughs> i'm doing good up yo i think we're all doing pretty well ah. i wish to <laughs> yeah um, and so it has nothing to do with Christmas. It's just the kind of, it's just a, a, a powerful cosmic event that occurs once a year. I have no idea how I missed this crucial lore like, yeah, me neither. <laughs> yeah, this is, we, this, we, um, it came into being last year during Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> this is crucial lore, lady lore. 
When exile left to the roof, but the flip command. Ha ha ha! Yeah, um, unfortunately, the flip command has to be removed while the center hat is in our presence. Also, in case you're wondering, there is only one center hat. Lufi. Uh, Lufi. Mufi is wearing a replica center hat because, um, well, sort of. It's like, um, a. It's like a displaced time cloned in a way. That's just Mufi things. That's just Mufi things. Just girl things. <laughs> oh, right, because it's big bit expunged. Yeah, exactly. Mm hmm. <gasps> of course! In order to in really enjoy the center hat spirit, the center hat spirit, we're gonna need the power of the moon! Magical Mufi! Oh, it works perfectly. Mufi just stole her hat from a corner Santa. Shh! You can't give away all of her secrets! <laughs> Let's see. Toxic stab and torrent. Jesus. Boof. No worries. See you later, Ether. Hope you have a wonderful day. Let's just double speed. Spit. I'd... I... Yeah, my neck is still kind of bothering me. <laughs> Ouch. All right, so we're getting some... Um, we're getting levels on, on Viola, on Spirit Wet pretty quickly. Sleep Cure. A little bottle of foul smelling salt sure to wake uh, one party member from their sleep. Doesn't use up your turn. Ooh. I wonder how we get those. Oh, I bet you it's the right. We need to buy the, we need to buy the uh, the bonus upgrade for the doctor. How do we get over there? Hmm. Whoop. Hmm. Care to dance, cousin? What? No. Ah! It's a Martiusa, but a scary archangel. Archangel's Martiusa. I'm gonna superheated fists, and then we're going to smack it. Obligatory spooky event! It's so scary! Listen, we're not in spooky season anymore! More cute art coming up soon. Yay! A lot of spriting work. I'm excited to see it! This increases her attack, but not her defense, so we should be fine if we then use battery as well. No, I meant to... Right, I didn't use charge. Double crit anyway? Dang. Headshot! Yay! Funerian got headshot! I think she already had it. Donk. No. No, you are not my kin spirit. Oh. It's gonna be open now, huh? No, it's not. Huh. Well then how do we... Try another room? Okay. The spirit that spoke to me. What it want? What it could want? I dare not ask. No! 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 I don't want to 
fight level 43 and 46 traffic crabs. They go down instantly and it's just not the challenge. Oh, the painting. No? Okay. Can I remove the valve? You. Oh, that's right! Shonk. Yeah, I forgot about the water that was in that room. Thanks, Borb. Whoa! I didn't know I could break boxes doing that. Remove from inventory valve handle. Oh, the painting's back. All right, here we go. This must be the lair of the spirit who keeps my brother from me. I think it's an archangel. Whatever spirit, fairy, or devil seeks an audience with me. <laughs> I will not falter! Scout. <laughs> Lady no Oh, thank you. God, I love that sound. It's so good. Hmm. Go to bed, I thought. Good night, hope you Hope you have a wonderful night. Thanks for stopping by. This place feels unwelcoming. More so than the rest of this strange land. Hey, Magic Crab. Welcome! I've taken the liberty of opening Platform A for you to travel. Now what can I do for you, Lo-Fi? I'm Platform B. We had an arrival at Platform B a short while ago. The guest that arrived seems to be having an interest in the theatrical. Did you get to meet him on the way in? Now what can I do for you? Sir Abio. <laughs> yeah, we have to be fancy people. Alright, so now I can... I can... fly back here if I want to. Right? Yeah. So we're gonna head to the harbor... What? Are you serious? Hmm. So it's not the best fast travel location. Leading Macabre away from goats. Does it eat goats? Because I thought it had like a cow skull next to it, not a goat skull. Alright, let's rest. Mm. I have visited many a tavern in my home country, and none held such a quietness as this place. It is enjoyable. I can envision many a happy time has been spent within these walls. That's fancy. In my case, more tempting to be overly polite. I like it. It's not bad. <laughs> it comes. It came off as. It came off as cute. Bless. Very bless. Now let's see if we can pull this off. Warm. Wing. All right, no idea what we're gonna need here, but I don't think Ralph is a good opening pick. I think Sploofy, I think we go Sploofy. Sploofy and Shoku. Shoku's a pretty good pick. Pretty strong. <laughs> this is no place for us, Lo-Fi. The very floor beneath our feet cries out as such. We are not welcome here. Can you not feel it so? A sense of wrongness that lingers in the air, making it hard to breathe. I can. Looks like we're gonna meet Al again. I was expecting more. I must ask for a quiet, please. All the world's a stage, and the show is about to begin. What? what show? Who are you? Why, I am but a merry wanderer of the night. They call me Hobgoblin and Puck. Oh, oh my God! I am Robin Goodfellow. Oh no! And you and I, Viola of Messaline, share much history. Oh, I love that. I love that style with the, with the, um, I don't know what the actual name of it is, but with the alternating, like, like, uh, shadings, you know, like the, the, like, uh, penciling on the, on the body. I love that kind of, I'm going to be history. <gasps> no, you're going to be history, Robin Goodfellow. The spirit, 
I have not I have not seen another like it. It is as if it is not meant for our world. To even look upon it feels heretical. I discovered this book among the remains of the ship. A curious read. Let me see. Page 645, Twelfth Night. The comedy of Viola of Messaline, who is shipwrecked on an unknown country. I do not understand. Ah, oh, yes, here I am. Page 365, A Midsummer Night's Dream. A story of fairies of King Oberon, Queen Titania, and the trickster Robin Goodfellow. But I love the limited Shakespeare they used for this game. It's so English, Glass. My dear Viola, you and I, we are merely inventions of a mortal playwright. And Mr. William Shakespeare in particular. Oh! Viola! That does sound familiar. That's not the Tempest, is it? Twelfth Night. I see. I've never heard of the Twelfth Night, actually, so I guess I don't- I didn't know that. Oh, wait a minute. What's- what is the Twelfth Night? Let me get a little synopsis for this. Looks like Viola is already history. A young woman of Messaline. Wow! So if I had read- oh my god, if I had read Twelfth Night, I would have known. Absolutely would have known. Cesario and secures a position as a page working for the Duke! Yes! I know this one! I had the Duke Orsino! Yes! I've read- I've, uh, I've watched a video essay on this- on this play. I was wondering if that might have been what it was. But I didn't remember her name being Viola of Messaline. Very interesting! It's a- it's a comedy of errors. It's very- it's very interesting. Our stories are not our own. Sebastian is not here. He will never be here. Sebastian. Yes! Oh my god. You will only find your brother when your tale demands. Does this Robin Goodfellow speak the truth, Lofi? Are these stories he reads known in your world? It's true. Thank you. Thank you. You know I speak the truth. Let the truth of it wash over you. Let it pull you into its depths until you can no longer gasp for air. I believe. <laughs> I believe your truth changes nothing. It may be that in Lofi's land I am but a story. Who's to say Lofi is not a tale in mine? This future that has been written for me is but words on paper. I defy them! Oh, heck yeah! Ha ha ha! How unexpected! This play is even greater than I could have hoped. Come, let us see the final act! Oh yeah, baby! Midsummer Night's Dream. Alright, oh, right, I can't fuse yet. I'm gonna smack myself. Oh, not trick. Oh, no! Lo-fi. The overwhelming hand of fate may push against us, but... We shall not perish upon this day! Our story does not end here! Lo-fi and Viola's eyes! Act as one! Rambolt! Uh. God, I love this! Yeah! It's so wild how the first time we fuse is when we, when Kaylee and I fuse is when we met the first Archangel and nearly died. And then everybody else has these like really, really intense like stories. Let's see. Charge time! Did you want? Don't smack me. Fairy dust. Hey! Uh oh. This could be a minor problem. 
It doesn't use a turn though, which is good. Battery! Right, right, right. She did get the cold story arc. You're right. Oh, not shrapnel. Why couldn't I near- Oh, because I didn't have the AP for it. Right, but Kaylee's cold story arc, which makes- would, which would make sense as- Thank you! Kaylee's cold story arc would make sense! Oh. Are you kidding? I actually got the 50% chance. Kaylee's cold story arc makes sense as, like, the- when we learn to fuse, because it's her personal thing. It was very- that, that's- I lost track of the point I was making. The, the point I was making is that everybody else's, like, big emotional uh, reveals and everything are all lead- all lead into how they learn- learn to fuse with us. But Kaylee's big emotional thing was already- we already learned and knew how to fuse, and that was just her second heart. I'm really worried about what this- what his- his special is gonna be. Damage roll! No, it needs to be melee. Charge time! Please don't tell me you took the bomb. Fairy horde! Tick, tick, tick! Stop putting me to sleep! Should I nurse or should I just go for it? Magic tome! I'm just gonna send it. Oh, right, status block. I'm gonna use a rewind. I'm not gonna waste the AP for it. Stop tricking me! Status effects are so annoying! Come on, come on, we've almost got him, I know it. Thunder Blast! Yeah! Let's use damage roll. 17! Yes! Got him! Upgrade! Doesn't really matter anymore, does it? Your stamina increased by 8%. I can now glide for 6.5 seconds. Here we go. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. To the west, your wings must fly to the place only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie, halls now empty and alone. Venture there and head northbound where your wayward paths shall meet. Where towering trees spring from the ground and dark grass bows beneath your feet. An altar of stone in this land atop it is where you must be. Three possessions must now leave your hand. The choice is yours, but must be three. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. You seem to be in a bit of a bind, don't you, Mr. Goodfellow? Let me extend a helping hand. I have a new role for you. Do you even understand this place, human? Do you even feel these tunnels breathing? <sighs> we would be wise to return to our place of safety. Yeah, let me kind of explain what all that was about. Thank you. Thank you for accompanying me on this quest, Lo-Fi. I believe Robin Goodfellow was wrong. It may be that my life has been a story in other realms, no. but it matters not. My future is mine to write. I will end find the end of my story on my own terms. <laughs> But from the moment we tied our hearts together in battle, you become part of my story, too. Tied our hearts. I refer to our moment of union in our great battle. When we became of one body, I felt our fates intertwine also. Whilst we may have since parted, I feel that the threads of fate are not so easily disentangled. You say that you know of a doorway to leave this land. That's right. Perhaps if this is found, then I shall be reuni reunited with my Very brother. Well. Very well! Let me repay my debt. I shall aid you in your own journey. Threads of fate? <gasps> Fusion is now available in regular battles and partnering with Viola. Fusion's you form with Viola, now I have plus 5% added strength. 
What agenda may our foe Aleph be devising? I do not trust the plans of spirits, Lofi. Oh, last, you spoke of something else. A clue hidden in a verse that you wish to investigate. Three possessions must now leave your hand. The choice is yours, but must be three. To me, this reminds me of a code, like a secret gesture or a knock. An action you must enact in order to enter a place of great secrecy. Perchance we should resume our travels once more. Did you not hear a rumor of an incident in Eastern Woods? That could be our next objective if you wished. The land keepers. True. So, perchance! <laughs> Did she actually say perchance? Right. Right, let's go. Bonjour. Bonjour. Bonjour, Clemence. I'm gonna grab some of these. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir, Clemence. I love Clemence. They're so cool. She sure did. No, I didn't. Well, well, and that concludes my report. Our hydroelectric generators are all fully functioning. We might need some new parts in the next couple of years, but it's small stuff. Not bad. Not bad. Not a bad state of affairs for the town, then. Thanks for your report, Levi. It's a miracle that we have running water and clean energy at all. I worry sometimes that things could change. Silent is unpredictable. <laughs> <laughs> Don't stress about it, Captain. Even if Arbortown's fortunes were to change, the Rangers will be here to make the best of it. Oh, I did? Oh, I did, so I lost Shoku. Thank you. Thanks for saying that. You're right, of course. Thanks, Borb. Hello. Hello, sweetie. Well, I have three of these. I'd like to try to... Provide additional resources to Dr. Pensby, allowing her to stock one additional kind of cure. I want to grab this. I'm going to grab this, too. And then this as well. Ta-ta! Ta-ta! Alright, we'll head back to the Gramophone Cafe. Where's Viola? Cool. Very well! Very well! Hugs! Big hugs! Alright. Right. Yeah, I just... Hmm. I really want to use... Um, Kuno Kunoko? Kuneko. I really want to use Kuneko. Who should I replace? I'm honestly thinking about replacing Mega Violence. Like, I like Mega Violent, but. Mm. Mega Violent's really interesting for, like, the way she. the way she, like, plays. She's probably the most interesting, like. She's probably got the most interesting kid on the whole team. But. And Kaneko is wind, if I remember correctly, so we don't really need Kaneko. But I want her so bad. We're just gonna we're just gonna use her. We're just gonna use her. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna store uh, Mega Violent for just a little while. Possibly. And we're gonna use Kaneko. Okay, I gotta go turn on my um uh, Astral Core. I'll be back in just a minute.
again. I've returned. Hi, guys. All right. So I got myself some apple slices. are way easier <clears throat> to turn into slice than I thought they'd be. I was always like, they have a big core. What do you do about that? Ah, it's actually very simple. <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you. Honestly, this probably won't come very good, but I got it. <laughs> very good, but I got to go. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed listening, hearing about my apple slices, Corin. I hope you have a wonderful day. Thanks for stopping by. Let's see. Let's go get some medicine. We're going to go to the pharmacy because I don't really, I don't think we ever checked out her stock before. Thank you, Corin. Kaylee's place. Is this the? Hello. Welcome, Doctor. Hey, Doctor Pensby. I'm looking for supplies. All right. So she has rewinds, respools, reodorants. She also has poison and burn cures. Yeah, these are fantastically good. All right, we're gonna grab some of these. When the sleep cure is the biggest issue. Sleep cure is very important. Oh, coding cure. Yes. Conductive cure. Uh, I'll grab them anyway, because we have plenty of plastic. A hypernormic needle containing an enzyme that immediately neutralizes excess intoxicants, removing the confused status effect from one party member. Doesn't use up your turn. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah, I'm, these will definitely come in handy. I think originally you only had the poison and burn cure. Bop, 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 bop. Love, guess what? I might be on Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Ooh, fun. Multi-stream. Multi-stream is just a little too complicated for me. Plus, um, <laughs> I mean, there's also other issues I have with it in that, um, nah, doesn't matter. But yeah, um, <laughs> but yeah, the, um, I do, <clears throat> I've considered multi-streaming on YouTube before. Good luck. If that does happen, though, Kabax, good luck. Also, welcome to the stream. How are you doing today? You having a good day? Thanks, no problem. Pop Gorgie, Pop Nemo, Twitch Global. Oh, I didn't know that was a Twitch Global. Bye. Goodbye. Trying to get yourself hurt too badly out there, okay? Thanks, Dr. Pensby. You're the best. Alright, so where are we going next? Uh, let's go check out the lost dog. So the biggest problem I have with this particular station is that you you can't you have to you have to start inside the the, sh the sunken ship. Also, I completely forgot. Ah, no! So tired of these things. Smack yourself. Double peekaboo. Rude ambush, exactly. Yes, these ambushes have absolutely no sense of decorum. No, oh, not flirt. Double flirt? Mm -hmm. Mm. 80s JRPG, yeah. You true. Let's see, um... I mean, if we're being honest, Ralph and Shoku are just better for this encounter. Transform! 
Transforming! Oh. Ice wall, huh? <laughs> Let's see how long that ice wall stands up against the power of flame! Wait. Oh no, it's just gonna turn into a water wall. But then I can use by uh, use uh, I can use electricity on it. We're gonna deal with that guy later. I'm not even gonna bother with that. We're gonna use heroic blade on this Undyan. I'm gonna use charge on both of them. Cause you wing, cause you wing. Ah. Well, that's interesting. I guess the ice is also is ice also grounded. Wait, what? What did I get hit with? Must have hit me with plant. Oh! Ice is also weak to lightning. I didn't know that. I'm gonna heroic blade this undying. Let's see. I'm gonna... I guess I'm just gonna smack this one. Smack you. Ice is just solid water, so the logic follows. I suppose it does. I suppose it does. Oh, the animation for Icebreaker is so good. Conductive! And then we just finish it off with um, Heroic Blade, and we'll go with Battery as well, just in case. Nice! Yeah, unit target is dangerous because if you use a single target, it makes all multi-target moves single target, and it makes all single target moves have less accuracy. <gasps> Yay! Kuneko got double slice! BRBC is in board. Water is just liquid ice. It is. No, 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 come on! Uh. All right. Oh, I'm actually in water. Oh, I'm in deep water here. <laughs> I still win, you fool! You cannot stop me! Vine ball. Ah. Are you here to research the pint-sized domino room or two? The gossip points to this location, but so far, so far I've only seen regular-sized domino. Maybe it all has something to do with the train that passed by underground a moment ago. Nah. Welcome back, Voib! Kabax, thank you for the only contribution to the wheel stream. What's this do? Bishwing. Almonds are getting low, guess I better show up. Yeah, I guess so. There's only one remedy for that. Yeah, that's what I would just yeah, that's what I was gonna say, actually. There's only one remedy for that. Not showing up more often. No, Kaylee! friendly dog. You know what's funny? My best friend I always goes by Kaylee. Oh, really? <laughs> That's fine. It's a friendly dog. Ever extended your hand to let the dog sniff you, you check his collar. 
The dog's name is Barkley, and there's a miniature tape recorder attached to his collar. There's no information about his owner here other than a 22-digit telephone number. Barkley must be stuck in New World, too. Aw, poor Barkley. Aww, baby! Barkley's looking up the cliff and whining. He must want to go up. You can get up there with your climbing ability. Will you go with him? Sure. No way! I had a feeling, but I'm I'm still kind of surprised. Oh! It- Pom Bomb? Wait. Pom Bombs are universally considered to be one of the friendliest creatures of New World. If it weren't for their habits of accidentally setting anything and everything on fire, they would make quite good pets. I'm confused. Why did it tell me that I- Oh, because it is an ice bootleg! Oh, I just didn't have a Pom Bomb yet! Aww! Barkley has an ice bootleg pom bomb. That's so cool. No, can't read. Bye, Kaylee. I know what Barkley wants up on Mount Wirral. What's funny is I could have just done it this way, but they probably wouldn't have let me do it if I didn't have the climbing ability. Oh my god! Oh my god, Barkley uses a balloon! Barkley didn't have any trouble getting up the cliff. It seems like he just wanted someone to accompany him. Alright, let's go, Barkley. Yeah, I can sequence break. You have to use a mat you have to use the cube! <laughs> Power flying boxes, baby. Arr. Oh. Oh, well. Hi. Oh, no. A very revoir. A very revoir. Okay. What level is it? 50. Okay. Well, Barkley can lower its accuracy. Barkley is very low level. Or Barkley's Barkley's bomb bomb form is. Charge! Oh! Wait, what? What? Uh, why? Lofi and Barkley's hearts act as one. I'm so confused. Pin bomb! Oh my god! It always works. It always works. Why does it- the phone cannot be halted! Cube! <laughs> well, we're gonna catch this ev- Miss Avrevois? Is that- I did, I fused with the dog. I have absolutely no idea why, there was no lead up to it at all. Battery! Okay, so here's the thing. Is this an evolution or... Sticky dung. Is this a legendary or is this an evolution of the, uh, of the Macabre? Oh, I bet it is because Macabre is, it's a legendary, is it? Macabre is also a French name, word, French word. I'm a little worried about hitting too hard. I don't want to kill it. Let's just smack it. Tower defense? Whoa. Characters with tower defense become earth type and have raised defense stats. Okay, not Copper Chop! And me without my, me without my Mega Violent. <laughs> yeah, that would be ridiculous. Mm. 
Let's see. Um, what's this? <laughs> Why you're so silly, Misha? That would be never. That would never happen. It'd be impossible. I mean, imagine me and Moo. Come on, me and Moo Fi fusing together. No, no. Uh, no, never. That'd be so. That'd be so silly, right, Moo Fi? Yeah, no, that'd be silly. Let's see, um... I'm just gonna smack it again. Wait, no. It's Earth-type now. How do we get rid of its tower defense? I don't remember what it said. It's a really cool concept for a, for a monster. Who's cooking, cooking bologna, bologna pasta? Nope, it failed. Uh, this is probably a bad fusion. I'm gonna rewind. No, okay, that was close. <sighs> Brick blast. Obnoxious. It has a lot of plastic. Oh, the coating doesn't go off. Interesting. Hmm. We're gonna unfuse. Idea. I'm gonna smack Evrevoir again. And I'm gonna have Barkley. Oh, look at Bomb Bomb's little picture. Oh my god. I'm gonna have Barkley transform into Sploofy. Miss. Okay, good. No, not damage roll. Oh, thank god. God, I've been trying to avoid using damage roll. Why is my fusion bar already full again? Okay. Okay, I'm like really nervous about this. I'm gonna use damage roll. I'm gonna try to record it with a chrome tape. Woof, woof. That's a bad recording chance. I missed. Yeah, because of Unit Target. I need to switch off of. Okay. I need to switch off of you. I need to switch to Funerain. Then I need to. I need a new leaf lo fi. Hello, Mr. Mug! How you doing today? Dang it, it's gonna fail. Oh, right, plastic just lowers my AP. Nice, thank you. Right, it's poison. Poison enrages. Wait, no, poison and steel enrage. It's the the AP drain is only plastic. Dog, I love the limited 3D they used for this game. It's so charming. I'm doing good, Mr. Mug. How you doing? Have you had a wonderful year, a wonderful day, a wonderful life? <laughs> I'm eating apple slices. It's a good idea to get regular amounts of vitamin C. Wait, do you always have vitamin C? I thought they did. Steady break.
vitamin C? Is apple a good source of vitamin C? 10% of a day a person's daily vitamin C needs. Okay. Yeah, okay. I guess that makes sense. Celebrating Agnes Varga. Hmm. All right. Now I'm going to try. I'm going to try using boil and recording using a chrome tape. I'm excited tomorrow for tomorrow for Pokemon because the second DLC is. Oh, is it? Neat! Ah! Dang it! Boil! Boil alive! That's right, I used all my stone tapes! Alright then. Time to new leaf. You! Wait, no, 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 because... Alright, basic tape. What was I ever for before? Wind. I don't have any wind tapes! Are you kidding? Bleah! All right, no worries. I don't have any glass tapes, do I? I didn't get any. Hmm. I'm gonna use a basic tape on Evrevoir and use New Leaf on it as well. That should get rid of its transformation. 3% chance. Copper Chop. Annoying. Nah, yep. I forgot he had Copper Chop. New Leaf's gonna fail now. Okay. Do I have an Angie Cure? I don't have an Angie Cure. <laughs> Excuse me, I don't have an Angie here, so I'm just gonna have to hit you with Boil and record with Barkley. Please don't kill Barkley. I'm just begging you not to kill Barkley! Okay, there he goes up to 11. Boil! 21. Dang it! Please don't let please don't let this be the same. <laughs> please don't let this be another instance of the of the glystrain of the glystain uh phenomenon. I beg you. We're gonna use this. Because he keeps attacking Barkley, so. Oh. Raise shields, huh? Magic tome. Twenty-one percent. Come on, man! I didn't realize they were releasing another DLC. Is it? Is it just like the second episode of the one they already released? So is it going to cost the same? Or I mean, is it? Is it any extra? Or is it just going to be the same? Or is it going to be another another purchase? No, no, no. We record with... Lo-Fi. The Magic Tome with Barkley. Nah. Now he's attacking Lo-Fi. Why? I am legit so confused. Yes, we got him! Wait, the Avervoir flight ability? 
<gasps> Everyone who was is an almost mythical being having only been sighted a dozen times in the entire history of New Wirral. Local legend says that the planet clasps and its beak can cure any illness and grant eternal life. Not that anyone's obtained it to prove that this is true, of course. Are you serious? You get an ability off this guy? That's nuts! I still have to record? Yeah, it was a bit difficult, yeah. Not as hard as Glystane, of course. Let's see, um... Um... What, is, what about Sprig? I like Sprig. Because of the, uh, the plant that it keeps in its beak. I kind of like Sprig. That's a fast monster! Oh my god. I think that's faster than Shoku. Mm -hmm. You can help us again while gliding to gain a boost. This consumes your stamina. Really? Sprig was put in storage. <laughs> Goodbye! Ba -ba -ba -ba. Pinnacle got sharp edges. Pom Pom got icebreaker. Nice. Glystate will forever be the hardest to record. I don't care what anyone says. <laughs> yeah, same, honestly. I was literally fighting to record Glystain for, uh, I think it was an hour. I think it was a literal hour that I was trying to record Glystain. It would have been the 8th? No, the 6th. It would have been the 6th. November the 6th. No, November the 6th was my st <laughs> that stupid AI voice clip. Alright. The news, the game sells Master Balls. Like, wait, really? Oh, I didn't want to know that. I didn't want to know that. But I, okay, cool. Good to know. Okay, so we started catching Glystane. We started we started fighting Glystane at three hours into the stream. We stopped fighting Glystane at three hours and fifty-three minutes into the stream. <laughs> We caught Glystane at nearly four hours into the stream, and we started catch trying to catch Glystane at three hours into the stream. It took me an hour to catch Glystane. That was brutal. All right. Yay! We caught ourselves in Avawa! <gasps> right! This area! The human bones! I remember this now. We went here. Among the bones, the dog leashes the treat. <laughs> <laughs> no! I'm not okay with this! Barkley digs a whole big hole in the pair of you bury the bones. Afterwards, Barkley gives your hand a big wet lick. <laughs> Fusion is now available in regular battles when partnered with Barkley. <laughs> Come back and stay. I'm gonna cry. Ah, so close. Oh. Oh. There we go. Neat. Huh, cool. Nice! You can like flap to get a higher, to get higher! That's so cool! Well, yeah, I mean, catching this guy is kind of a big deal then. Platform. 
Hmm. This mountain area is beautiful. I think this is called a spooky on I don't remember. Okay, so we found dog friend. Um, cackling. The cackling man at the graveyard, or a deep cackling laugh, I think is what they called it. Right. Right, let's go. Alright, taking my girlfriend out with me for monster battles. Uh, discuss fond memories of places you've been. The dog is now legally yours. It is mine. But uh, Barkley is now legally mine. I refuse to hear anything else about it. <laughs> Artillerex? The heck is an Artillerex? That sounds nuts. Okay, so I'm a little confused because can we check the song? Play song. You must rise the task at hand, walk the path most long to the west. Your wings must fly to the place on the island. No, that's where my chambers lie. Hall is now empty and alone. And northbound, where your wayward path shall meet, where towering trees spring from the ground and dark grass bows beneath you. That sounds like the forest. An altar of stone in this land, atop it is where you must be. Three possessions must now leave your hand. The choice is yours, but must be three. Okay. Atop a stone altar at the woods. That sounds like an all. Hmm. Sounds like this thing. That's a landkeeper's office. Um. Hmm. Tall trees and dark grass is definitely Eastern Woods. But that's not to the west, that's to the east. That's why they call it Eastern Woods. I mean, it's the north. It's not even east or west, it's just north. If we're talking west, it'd probably be somewhere around here, in like the Lost Hearts graveyard or the marshes. But there are no trees around here. Oh, I mean the cherry meadow, I guess. But it's not dark grass. Would it be around here? Yeah, it was the Neko altar was the first thing I thought of. It was the Kaneko altar. But I don't remember where the Kaneko altars are, actually. <sighs> I have fought you. Cool. No! Not since Nixon took us off the ghoul standard have we seen such a rush to purchase property. A rush? You guys have- nobody wants property. Rude. Why did she get a preemptive strike? That's so annoying. We're gonna take Funerain and just have Kaylee burn the Yorman Gold. Oh, easy. Cool story! And spit. This Yorman Gold is fast. I'm really impressed. <laughs> the population of New Weirl keeps growing, but nobody has thought to build new homes. It's a perfect setup! It's actually not, though. You guys are so off base. God, this flight ability is so cool. Here. I usually use like poison types, right? So let's move Sploof. And we don't have an answer to poison, which is really strange. 
I, yeah, because I got rid of my metal stuff. I even took out... Ah! If I still had... Right, I was using poison against poison. Because she has metal... Because she had copper chop. Uh, Kaneko might just be a bad fit for the team. I don't know. Um, I'm going to use Shoku. Hey, guys. Skull. As prospective tenants, it is in your best interest to remain on good terms with the Landskeepers Association. You wouldn't want to be cast out of your homes, would you? Hi. That sounds like a threat to me. It does. Let's go broadcast and then we'll use inflame with uh no we'll use peekaboo where 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 pin bell is such a good fun haha -ha, you missed haha -ha, you missed smack that roll again ability is really good. Honestly, it most it hits almost all the time. It says it's a chance to automatically use another move, but I think it just straight up is every turn it uses another move, another random move. So I guess if you have like roll again, headshot, and free start, you're basically headshotting every single turn. That seems a little overpowered. <laughs> Oh, wait, that's right. In order to ride, right, you have to have the AP to use roll again. I completely forgot. That's why it fails sometimes. It's because you have to have the AP. All right, I have an idea. We're going to use inflame first. Uh oh, might not have been a good idea. Revenge strike. Yeah, that was a bad idea. I should have used damage roll. Your tape broke. What are you gonna do about it? Rip Terra. It's battery time. Actually, hold on. No, it's charge time. And then we use damage roll. Hey, that did like no damage. That was actually really sad. Why did he get to use two moves? Oh, Revenge Strike was a right. Revenge Strike is the passive. Gotcha. I completely forgot. Ta-da! We leveled up. Kuneko got bad joke. User tells a random joke. This has no effect. It's still an awesome move. Don't knock it. Perhaps you'd be interested in speaking to our manager at the association headquarters. Maybe we can reach a mutually beneficial agreement there. I shall give you the location. Ah, finally. Ah, uh, this is... Was that the last office cleared out? Let's hope they don't come back. It's less than I thought it would be. It smells strongly of rotten eggs. Okay, so now we just have to get... We just have to pair up with Eugene. Fine ball. Alright. Yes, you need to bring I had a feeling. I figured, because it's probably Eugene's fusion uh fusion mission. Bonjour. Bonjour. <laughs> Alright, we'll use we'll get five broken tapes. Chrome tapes. We'll get five chrome tapes. Au revoir. Au revoir. But my limos. Eugene. Uh, hold on. Yeah. Okay, Kaylee chats to you about the places on Earth she'd like to visit. I love that sentence. Because it seems like such a goofy sentence. Ugh. <laughs> My neck is killing me. Unfortunately, you've had little reason to use them this whole time. Exactly. What? What? The Landkeepers have a central base of operations? 
This is our chance to put a stop to them once and for all. Come on, we haven't got a moment to waste. Company Eugene to the location of the Landkeeper's HQ. There's a reason, right? Because I believe his... Oh, Cloxley. Cloxley, really? Okay. Wait, I thought Cloxley was like a really common one that we've seen before. No, it isn't. Ooh, I wonder what Cloxley remasters into! Very cool. Foxley's a signature. Gotcha. Uh, and, um... Wait a minute! Does that mean... Hold on. Where is Pom Pom? Uh, where is Pom Pom? Oh. Wait. Are pom bombs like late in the game? I didn't realize that. I thought they were like early on. Pom bomb is not Barkley's signature. An ice pom bomb is, but does that mean that ice pom bomb can turn into something? Pom bombs are our early game. That's what I thought. Cryo Shear. So cool. Does that mean that an ice pom bomb becomes something completely different? Curious. Yeah, the ice type bootleg is the most common one, I think, because of uh, because of Barksley. All right, let's head to the let's head to the landkeeper's office. It's over here in the marshes. All right, come on, let's go. Come on, Eugene, keep up. I'm sorry, what? What do you mean? Now that's how you do an ambush! <laughs> Look at the form! Now this is a proper ambush with proper etiquette! Look at Glystain just standing out here menacingly waiting for me to appropriate approach. Oh, legendaries can replace rogue fusions. Oh, that's really interesting. So it's possible then that you can get uh, that you can get bootleg legendaries. Interesting. Or at least it's approachable to get bootleg legendaries. I should say. What's this? Yep, there it is. This is supposedly the location of the landkeeper's headquarters. All right. All right. These creeps are no match for our burning resolve. Nee. Uh, Where is the entrance anyway? Oh wow. Whoa, that's kind of neat. Hmm. I think I found the entrance. Me too. Whoa. Well, uh, okay. Here we go. No music at all. No fixed rate mortgages! Increasing equity! Adjustable market cap rates! Whoa! Capital growth! <gasps> yep. It's an oh my god, that's terrifying. Oh, that's terrifying! What? What? How? Does that thing look like that? It's breaking my brain! I guess this is an archangel, huh? Thank you for arriving at our scheduled meeting. Your cooperation is greatly appreciated. So you're behind this, huh? So tell me, why would an archangel try to take over the property market? My kin are born of humanity's ego. The strongest desires of your kind give us form. I exist as tribute to mankind's consumption. I want order because you do. I crave structure because you do. 
I want what you want, human Eugene. I can read your heart. You don't know a single thing about me. I sympathize with the human Eugene. The human Eugene finds no value in themselves outside of their cause. Without a cause, the human Eugene is nothing. A hollow shell just like my agents. I... That's not true. Stop. Whoops, I didn't know. I didn't mean to click it. I don't know what I clicked. Stop! I'm not listening any longer. You won't crush my spirit. That's all your kind knows how to do. Some bigwig comes along and tries to take everything from the little guy. And then when the little guy fights back, they're told not to step in a line, right? So they don't do anything and things just get worse. <sighs> it's the same old story. Lo-Fi, want to burn down this pile of junk? You know I do. Rare. <laughs> Archangel Mammon, head landkeeper. This is the boss of the of landlords. This is the boss of landlords, you guys. <laughs> this is exactly what he looks like. Finally, the final boss of rent. <laughs> it is. Yeah, this is the boss that you face if you if you uh, don't pay your rent for long enough. But if you can manage to beat it, you never have to pay rent again. <laughs> Secret strat they don't tell you. <clears throat> Mind meld! Bam. That's not good. That's real bad leverage. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, he raises his attack but lowers his defense. You're not gonna crush my spirit! And you won't stop Lo-Fi so easily either! We'll take you on together and we'll win! Ramball, baby! Please be Ramball. Lo-Fi and Eugene's heart act as one! Rambled. Oh, right, we've seen Rambled before. Oh, that's right. His name isn't Shoku. His name is Pinbolt. I completely forgot. <laughs> I'm gonna smack myself. Lost leader. Oh. Oh. You're gonna keep using leverage? Okay. Nice, roll again. Oh, this is gonna be tough. Let's use charge. Hold on. So, Sploofy's melee attack and Shoku's ranged attack are the highest. Our melee attack should be decent. Wait, what? Oh man, Shoku's a ranged attacker. I need to swap out charge and battery then. But I can use it right now. Charge time! Yeah, that's why charge doesn't charge and battery don't do anything. Okay. <laughs> Nurse! Lost leader is so strong. Margin call! Uh oh. Oh, shoot. That's not good. That's real bad. Okay, well, now I'm enraged, so I have a, so we have a problem. Market crash! Ooh, I'm glad I used the heal. Our ranged attack should be pretty good here. So let's use Thunder Blast. No, damage roll. What am I doing? Damage roll is incredible. Yeah, there we go. <gasps> AP drain! Wait, why did why AP drain? What type is he? Oh, he's earthly types. Neutralize. Uh oh. Well, that's not good. He 
can neutralize his- Okay, so neutralize lets you- That's ridiculous. Neutralize lets you get rid of your negative stat- The status changes, but not your positive status changes? That's so overpowered. Damage roll! Nine. There's Lost Leader. I just realized if it was the other way around, it would be Pintergeist. <laughs> Pintergeist is such a goofy name. All right, so, um, go for it. Damage roll, a 10. There's Lost Leader. Uh, not margin call. No! Dang it! Rewind. Multi smack does absolutely nothing. Or maybe it does. We. Jesus! Yay! We won! We beat Mammon! Shoku Kuneko is at four. We got return fire on Cloxley. Nice! In an upgrade! Thank you! Yeah, baby! Hot stuff indeed! Save an increase by 8%. I can now glide for seven seconds. Looks like we're almost done. One left after this. If you wish to leave this land, then heed my words and hear my song. You must rise to the task at hand. You must walk the path most long. The west, your wings must fly to the place only I have known. For that is where my chambers lie. Hall's now empty and alone. Venture there and head northbound, where your wayward paths shall meet. Where towering trees spring from the ground and stark grass boughs beneath your feet. An altar of stone in this land atop, it is where you must be. Three possessions must now leave your hand. The choice is yours, but must be three. Unite this act and its location to show you to the final station. The rest of the song is too quiet to make out. Hmm. Ho <laughs> oh, ho! Quite the operation you have here, Mr. Mammon! It looks like you can delegate. That's a valuable skill. Let me help you get out of here. <sighs> you know you should show me a bit more respect. Your world is legends based on me. You're lucky I'm so humble. Yep, Aleph. Aleph. Oh. This place is falling apart. Come on, we gotta go! What? It's literally. What? Wait, full song got, really? It said the rest of the song is too... I guess all the landkeeper agents fled. I wonder what they'll do now that operation, their, their operation has been shut down. <laughs> Man, it was pretty cool when we fused in there. It was, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah, it was like an adrenaline rush, except I could feel your will driving me as well as my own. Even an archangel couldn't stop us. An archangel was behind the landkeepers all along, huh? What if it's, what it said there? What if it was true? Maybe without some cause to champion all the time, I am just a hollow person. I don't think you're a loser. <laughs> That's awful. You shouldn't think that way. Bologna and cheese pasta. Good, good, good. <laughs> huh. Thanks, man. What motivates you to do what you do anyway? You know, your journey, your journey around helping people out, fighting monsters and all that? I'm going to find a way to return home. Hmm. Hmm, sounds pretty improbable. <laughs> I beat the real estate vampires. I did. Hello, Red. How you doing? I'm in. Really? Yeah. Just like that. We've stopped the land keepers, but I don't want to just rest my feet. I don't know if I physically can. I need something to strive towards. So let's do it. A new cause to I'm work in. towards. I'm in. Literally just proving his point. But I mean, you know what? If that's how, if that helps you, then go on and go for it. You and Aaron, curious to see where you are when I come back. Yeah, me too, actually. I can now use fusion when pairing battling with Eugene. What did that mean when you said that there's legends based on him? Well, um. I know Aleph is the first letter of the Hebrew alphabet, I believe. How's it going with the lyrical leads of yours? It sounded to me like you had enough information to go off with them. Shall we hit the road again, buddy? You heard some rumors about something going down in the marsh, right? We could try going there. Also, a lot more people are learning about the word thanks to Genshin Impact, so... Genshin. All right. 
Vine ball. Vine ball. It's flight powers. Nice. The flight powers are so cool. But see you later, Access. You probably already left, but have a wonderful day. And see you soon. All right, we're going to hook back up with Kaylee. Hold on. No, because uh, he has Shoku. Bonjour. Bonjour. Bonjour, Clemence. I'll take a few rewinds. Sure. Au revoir. Au revoir. Yeah, I'll take Kaylee. Right. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use my one of my upgrades on Kaneko. Yeah, it'd be random. It's just... It's just... Um, Metronome, but kind of more interesting because it has to be a move you have enough AP for. Which I like. Let's rest. Kaylee chats to you about places on Earth she'd like to visit. Alright, Kuneko, let's do it! Remaster your Kuneko tape into a more powerful form! Yeah! Shiny Kuneko! Hugs, Borb. Oh, it's so cool. When Kaneko unites the four elements of the world within herself, she unlocks the true potential within herself. The cosmic energy flowing within her gives her a power level that is off the scale. Oh. Well, that's interesting. Huh. Big heart. Her stats are an even 140 across the board. Now I want to check something, and I'm not too, and I'm not patient enough to wait for it. Where? Ritual. It does. They do go up. Okay. They go up slightly when you. They go up slightly when you start them up. Interesting. Okay, so. Huggy. Let's see. I don't really like Bad Joke. I don't really like Ritual. I mean, I kind of like Ritual, I guess. It's very expensive. What can I replace this with? Excuse me. Tell me, fool. The last move the target used if you have the AP for it. Interesting. Energy wave. Three mana hits a whole team, plus 15% damage, plus 7% melee defense. Nice. That's kind of a cool move. Let's go with that. Be random is fun. I just made up my mind. I'm going to start my second run of this, but I'm going to do a randomized run. I'm going to say I'm 95%. Oh, fun! I'm not a huge fan of sharp edges. Um, You know what? Can you learn any camouflage moves? Doesn't look like a... Shoot. Okay, um... Very odd stat balance. Huh. Don't underestimate passive moves. Let's grab an air camouflage. Let's grab two of them. Phase shift. Oh yeah, the user's attacks can hit ghosts. Oh, it's a passive move. That's cool. Raises the user when an ally is defeated. You automatically start a battle, prevents opponents targeting users' allies. Ooh. So broken when you the rogue fusion became easier for me. Fair enough. I believe it. Rogue fusions aren't too typically diff aren't too typically difficult for me either. 
Um, well, I I honestly, as long as the, as long as I have type advantage against something they have, I can fill up my fusion meter in like five seconds. Oh, uh, oh. Keeper! Let me guess, you're calling back from the- Where? Where? Oh, it's sound the alarm! Like, sentry turrets pop out of the ceiling. Let me guess, you're calling back for revenge after we brought down your whole operation, huh? No, I think she's just trying to join us. We're all in. Uh, Eugene, I think there's something wrong with her. I think she's, uh, broken. What? I- I think you might be right. Sorry. Sorry about the hostile reception. Why don't you take a seat and we can get to know each other? Needs. Well. So, uh, are you feeling okay? Can you tell us about yourself? Off it down. The land keepers were minions in a archangel we defeated. Maybe when their boss fled, all their brains got fried. I still don't trust her. No. Job prospects. Aww. She doesn't exactly have a sunny disposition, does she? <laughs> sunny. Why do we call her Sunny? We have to call her something. No, I like Sunny. What happened to you? Land keepers. Bankrupt. Nothing left. Why still here? Maybe the land keepers only exist to carry out their jobs and now she doesn't know what else there is to do. Like a machine without a purpose. Ugh. Oh, you poor thing. Not a random words, my bear. Hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. Oh, yeah, we've still got about two hours left to go in the stream. It's gonna be a meaty one. Maybe if we don't see you later, then I hope you have an absolutely fantastic day, my dear. There's still plenty of time for you to make a fresh start. What? Fresh start? Maybe the first step is getting you some new clothes, Sonny. I'm sure wearing that outfit, that office outfit all day, is pretty miserable. That is agreed. Lo-fi lets me up at Harbor Town's tailor. It's on the upper level of Harbor Town, just north of here. How does it feel? Go to the tailor in Harbor Town to pick up help pick a new look for Sunny. Oh, we're going shopping! Yes! Oh my god, girl, we're gonna make you look so pretty! Okay, let's go. Is it here? Hmm. Usually cook food. Okay. That's strange that that hasn't come up yet. Oh. What's this? Hmm. I got a random starter. Ooh, and wood. Let's go. So it's somewhere around here. It's not there. It's not them. Is it you? It's right, oh, it's a grave. It's gotta be. Taking weeks. Whoa! <gasps> Ghost house! Astral, welcome, inquiring souls. Are you here to learn about the astral arts? Sure. Excellent. You would be wise to heed my words. Yep, I, um, yeah, if I remember correctly, we talked about this last time. Uh, it's random starter and headshot, and those are like the only two stickers that you use. That way, um, you can just, um, swap them out and they keep using headshot and just annihilating the opponent. You see, beasts of the astral type draw their power from the four basic elements of nature. Earth, water, fire, and air. An astral creature exposed to any of these four elements will be empowered. However, their internal harmony can be thrown into disarray by exposure to impure elements, plastic, poison, and metal. If you wish to take the form of an astral beast, remember this. Okay. Ghost. Hey! Taylor! Oh, hey! 
everyone's here. <sighs> I'm still not sure we should be helping her out. Are you forgetting the time her former employee tried to take over the island? What? what? Right, Sunny, I'll take you back here and you can poke and pick out some new outfits. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this, okay. Uh, I'm not sure about this, Kaylee. <laughs> I'm not sure about this one, Sunny. Better last rice, depending on you, is a special time. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's cute. I'm not sure. Hmm. That's not the direction I was expecting you to go. You don't look super, comfort super comfortable in that, Sunny. How about we try another? No. Oh. Oh, that's so cute! <laughs> okay. I think I look good. I. I. Kaylee, is it just me or is Sunny? Uh... Absolutely gorgeous? No, that's not just you. You look pretty cute, Sunny. Okay. This is me now. <laughs> Thanks for the help, all of you. I have some very mixed emotions right now. <laughs> We're glad to be able to help you, Sunny. I ever tell this everyone ever first start. It's only fair that that includes zombie estate agents. Land keepers are not zombies. Land keepers are vessels created to work. Not anymore. From now on, I will try to be Sunny instead. No, It's Sunny! Help Sunny start a new life. That's great! We got experience for that. Oh, fun. Hey, Lo-Fi. Aww. Hey. Okay, interesting. Well, here's my room. Chonk. Right, I can change my everything. That's very cool. <gasps> Doink. My flower vase! The lack of wind, but abundance of air. We're all in the same shit. All right, so... Now I just need to finish with the ranger captains. And the Land of Confusion thing. Right, there's one more song part, but I'm that's pretty much all that I need, I think. Interesting. Follow the path. Tall trees. Stone. Hmm. In that case, that is giving me... Welcome to Fall Down Mall! My, my guess is that I need to go to this altar and um, use like three consumable items. I'd be surprised if it was this one. But I can't just use items for free. So I need to make sure that three of my forms are damaged. And I still don't think this is like how you do it. I still don't think this is like the answer, but... Whoa! Oh, right. It could be. Hmm. I can also recycle them. Oh, I can. There's no way that's the answer. <laughs> Hi, Kaylee. <laughs> um, are you serious? Huh, a mirror. I wonder if this is like in the Amber Lodge. Is this... Are you kidding me? No way! 
はいはい We're not done. I. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my god. Knights mm. Bridge Station. Where are we now? It's so misty. I guess there's nowhere else to go but forward, Lofi. Like we can't leave? Wrong. You're wrong, Kaylee. You're just objectively wrong. We can leave. <laughs> oh. Okay. That's really cool. Getting kind of nervous. Solve the riddle of Morgante's song. Two swords. Oh! This place is vast! You should know what you have to do to get in here. What? No way! Oh, that's so cool! If this, if this, the doorway we seek is anywhere, it's gonna be here. We should look around. Oh, that's actually super cool. Hmm. Looks like we need some sort of gem for the stone. Hey, magic crab! You finally arrived! Welcome to Knightsbridge Station! The train arriving on Platform B is due to depart for other realities soon! You should make sure you catch it in time! And what can I do? Excuse me. What can I do for you, Lo-Fi? The train to Platform B will be departing soon. That's right, there's an active gateway in this station! You're almost home, Lo-Fi! Now what can I do for you, Lo-Fi? Uh... Sure. Very well. Beautiful music. Uh oh. Yep. Smongog! <laughs> I love him. His name is so cute. Ah, uh, these are some high-level dudes. All right, we're using Peekaboo. I really hope Phoenix doesn't use Gambit. Dang it! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Immediately. All right. Um. Um, we're gonna use Sonic. Can you Sonic? I'm gonna use. I'm gonna try to drain the AP out of Queenix. I'm gonna use a damage roll on both of them. Deja vu. Oh, right. Deja vu. Intercepted. Oh, interesting. That did nothing. I must have rolled really lowly. Lowly? Low? No, bolo lowly. I must have rolled really low. I guess we'll use a damage roll and smog my gog. Damage roll again. Beast wall. Oh, what an annoying cons. What an annoying combo. Fourteen. Uh oh, that's fine. That's Earth. Uh, I don't think we have anything that gets rid of. We'll just use Sonic Boom, and then we'll use um, yeah, um, hmm. we'll just use Spit. The Queenix isn't. Uh oh, no! Oh my God! Well, that was unfortunate. 
Critical mass radiation breath? What is critical mass? Well, now I have to know. Transform into Funerain! Chrome Kate. Smoke Magog! Recording! Recording! Boil. Nice. Why he's not Earth? He's fire. I keep he keeps using coal story, so I forget that he's Sorry. not with a fifty percent chance. Rome tape. On the western shore near that one land keeper office, and I had to jump on a log three times. Oh, that's so interesting. Puzzle fuel! I remember that one. Yay! I got him! Got it! Smogmagog! Smogmagog's bodies are actually outer shells made of steel and concrete that has a purely elemental fire beam with it. Heck yeah, he's super hot stuff! Fire beam within. As long as a single ember still remains alive within the shell, the smogmagog will continue to fight. Wicked. It doesn't- it has self-destruct, oh my god. It doesn't have critical mass, though. Automation. Chance to use the next move in the list for zero AP at the end of the turn. Ooh, That's really dangerous. And strong. I wonder if anybody else can learn that sticker. Smog Magog, what's his name gonna be? Um... He was on the northeast and at the start of the river waterfall. Oh. Well, for me, it was on one of Kuniko's shrines, the Kuniko's altars, and I had to discard three items. <laughs> I'm so funny. So let's see. Um. Oh, I like this. Cough drop. I like Cough Drop! We're going with Cough Drop. Welcome to the team, Cough Drop! Alright, we'll spit. We'll spit. <coughs> no! Not self-destruct! I forgot how self-destruct works. Yay! We got experience points! Don't even need to touch the ground. So if I hadn't... Yes, I got the flying. I didn't even need to hit the switch. <laughs> if I had known that was over there, I could have just immediately flown over. Wow, the flying is like the ultimate game-breaking ability. Fine Vault. No, I almost had it! Okay. <laughs> Lol, bye. Wait, 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 Um, hmm, 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 hmm. Oh. Hmm, hmm. I almost had it. Hold on. There we go. Dang it! Roll again. Metal and plastic. Neat! Plus 9% effect chance! <gasps> uh oh, did I just roll? Okay. Yes, yes, yes! 
success! <laughs> I did it! Alright, so let's get... Shoku a better roll again. Yay! Nope. Whoa, a rogue fusion. Okay. Hmm. Alright, let's respool. Um, let's respool Sploof Sploofy. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, King Nix. Uh oh. Is that a King Nix? Is that a, uh, a king and a queen fused together? That's a little unsettling. Ultimate answer. Oh, wait. No, I actually do have the ultimate. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I actually do have the ultimate answer. Transform into Shoku. And use Deja Vu. <laughs> don't, don't kill us. I'm really glad I had a smoke bomb. Uh, I died instantly. Oh my god. Well, that's not good. Okay. Hmm. Well, in that case, I have a better idea. I don't have any respools left, so we have to leave. Oh, right, can't fast travel here. Okay. Oh, okay. All right, time to go. Oh, actually, I just realized. Use on low faith. One. Two. Three. Four. Five! Now we're on equal footing. No! I... I didn't mean to hit that. Okay, well, I didn't mean to be one level above. Clearly, hopefully I can get another olive up so I can use it on... Stop, Luffy! I can't... I keep thinking it's just gonna do use, and then I pick who I use it on! Dang it! Kaylee's four levels behind her now! My finger keeps slamming! <laughs> no, I didn't want to be four levels above Kaylee! Jesus. How am I end up being four levels above Kaylee? Because I, because I got a level and she missed out on one. Yeah, okay. Or I got two levels, because I got two levels and she missed out on two, so it ended up being four levels. Math is strange sometimes. Let's go see if we can hunt down the rest of the captains. I really want to finish up the captains before... I'd like to finish up the captains before we go. And lower levels get more experience to catch up to higher levels? Oh. Hmm. Kaylee discusses her aspirations with you. Your broken tapes have been repaired. Let's go 
try to unlock more stuff with, uh, more stuff from Clemence. Oh. Wow. Well, do you miss it? Life in the big city, I mean? I know I do. It certainly was more exciting, but that doesn't mean life was better. I lived my whole life in a mega metropolis. The only trees I had seen were made in factories. The stars had long been blotted out by the skyscrapers and their neon facades. The value of life was fleeting and you had to harden your spirit if you wanted to stay alive in such a cruel world. You can imagine that when I first landed here, it took a long time for me to get used to this pace of life. <laughs> That's been more of an answer than I was expecting, boss. She's not gonna wanna leave. There's no way she's gonna wanna leave. Hello. Hello, sweetie, what are you after? I'm after winning. <laughs> Except I actually am more after losing, but uh, I mean, the people in the cafe get way less experience, but team up with them for a bit and they'll sling Oh, okay, cool. Hmm. I don't really care about the coffee, is the thing. I care more about... Yeah, I don't really care about the coffee. I care about, like, other other items that Clemens can give me. So, I guess I won't be buying the coffee. I can buy four more gym points. It's kind of... I can... Oh my god. An extra 17 pair of facilities? That seems so excessive and unnecessary. Tinned coffees. Each type of cure. Number of rewinds. Hmm. Oh, jumpkin seed. Having one of these in your pocket will upgrade your pumpkin vine ball with the ability to create a plant wall at the start of battle if it was in use before battle started. Fun. I would like to the ability to have more respools. If I'm going to be honest, re having more revives would be really, 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 really nice. Ta-ta. Ta-ta. See you later, Wilma. You! Well. You know Captain Cody, the one who's always moaning about not having an internet? He's up on Mount Wiro right now. Maybe I should like, hike up the mountain so I can finally find out what's so great about internets. There you are. Yo, greetings. Give me greetings, lo fi! How many different species have you recorded out there? Gracious. Goodness gracious, 63! Thank, Thank you for your work. Here's some compensation for your time. Ooh. Fun. Hold <gasps> oh, up! Yes! I got a toaster tape that I didn't need, plastic, fused materials, nice. Come talk to me again when you reach 70. Is that a fridge? It's empty. Oh. What if I check again? I can't. I'm gonna get some free stickers. Let's go for some wild card stickers. Air camouflage, glass can, and burning passion, and AP donate. Automatically raises the user's ranged and melee attack whenever the user gains the burned status effect. Interesting. Hello. Hello, sweetie. Let's buy the respool pouch. Let's see, and then we're back to four, which. Ta -ta. It's not fridge, it's empty. Ah! <laughs> Let's see. Um... Bonjour. Bonjour. I was actually going to suggest earlier that I thought, I'm like, wait, so I guess the speedrunners, they must have, they must learn, like, every combination that you can possibly have and then they go check all of them immediately but like even if you do you can't like beat the final sta like stages without getting stronger monsters so i have to wonder how a speedrun of this game would go it's really interesting it's got me super curious let's see let's buy some stuff i'll buy two more chrome tapes all right. Au revoir. Au revoir. Au revoir, Clemence. I love Clemence. You! Hmm. Mount Weirdo is pretty tall, huh? I heard there was some kind of crazy lighthouse at the top. What do you think is up there? Probably a lighthouse. Let's see. This is actually a really great place for it to be. Because this lets me 
jump right over to oh well maybe not because i have to go all the way through this part again Ball. Metal, the old one, two pulp, and a water filled tape. Very right, cool. Let's see if we can hunt down the captain around here. What's in here? Oh. Okay. Cool. Okay. Ah, they got me. Moth Cassell. I don't have anybody as Earth. <sighs> wow, Shining Kaneko looks way angrier now, baby. So we're in with a random scene like I'm doing now, getting an absolutely broken start if I'm lucky can make it easy? Ah, okay. Yeah, electricity is, yeah, weak to Earth. Oh, it is plant. Earth, plant, plastic, and glass. Perfect. Ralph and I don't know, Shoku? Plastic's good against electricity. Oh, this is a bad matchup. This is a real bad matchup. I don't know what to I don't I can't I don't know what to do here. I guess we'll go with Decibel. But Decibel's weak to electricity. My whole team is weak to electricity. And those that aren't are weak to plastic. Okay. If I remember correctly, plastic is just AP degeneration. So I should be able to still use... I should still be able to use lo-fi. I'm going to use astro coating. I'm just going to make... Well, mm, But then why don't I just use... I'm going to use smack. And then I'm going to switch to, Kine to Shining Kaneko. What does she have? I haven't really worked on her move set, have I? But her stats are really solid. Let's go ahead and switch into her. I'm actually really excited to see what she looks like, when we, what, what a fusion with her looks like. That did a lot of damage. Okay, um, go ahead and fuse. Love and Kaylee's hearts act as one! Ram Kuneko! Oh! <laughs> it's so cute! Magic Tome! Work mouse. Rewind. Ah, another clockwork mouse. Energy wave. Oh, God. I don't really have anything good here. Would have been such honestly it would have been a much better idea to use no because if i use fire it would have been poison which would have raged me and i don't want to be raged rage is so bad for us energy waving Ooh, 
Stop using exclusively Clockwork Mouse! Oh my god, it's getting so much AP every turn. <laughs> use nurse it's not enough I don't think magic tome there you go finally there's a yep mothman I can rack a cell Yeah, that's not gonna work. Go for it! Get rid of him! Ugh. 2,000 experience points and a bunch of plastic. This material, I swung wood, please. Basic tape! <laughs> Come on! All right. Well, now we are definitely not ready for um, for the captain if we find him. Help. Led the battle. Honestly, this is the second game in recent memory where um, one of the last people we fight, one of the last, um, like, organization heads we have to fight is on top of a mountain. Fun fact! What? Hello? Spark Tan? What are you? Oh, Violet. Pokemon Violet. <laughs> Glasmadler! Glasmadler? It was a really good name. I could really use, like, a campsite. Rain, a reminder of what order you did the violent gym leaders. Oh, that's right! <laughs> I forgot you can do them in any order you want. Kaylee discusses her aspirations with you. And thanks to being on a very tall, cold mountain, I'm gonna have to discuss my respirations with Kaylee. That's gotta be, you've gotta, it's gotta be, what? <laughs> Stay frosty, man. Level 50 cryo shear. All right, we're going Shoku in flame. Wah, 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 wah. Uh oh. Please don't miss, oh thank goodness. Cast Aurora Borealis. I didn't notice that. Now we're going to go for some fun. At this time of year, at this time of day, on this, on this world, yes. It's a different world. <laughs> Let's have some fun. Yeah. Frosty.
Ah. Can I see it? Sure. Well, hmm. No, I can't. I can't, like... I'm sorry. I can't, like, zoom in on it. I guess I could. Hold on. Aurora! There you go! <laughs> oh! Scary Aurora! See? There it is! It's floating. <sighs> I can't flee, huh? Can I use a... Can I still use a smoke bomb? Nope. Right, it specifically says you can't. Forgot about that. Charge time! Hmm. Ha ha! Sorry, traveler. My potions are too strong for you. I can't believe I got bolt from the blue. We use charge on Farius. We're gonna use inflame on it. Wait, I don't want to use charge. I want to use battery. Oh goodness. Smack. Rolligan is very powerful. Battery time. Gotcha. Oh, I. Alright, our team's kind of getting fleshed out a little. I lost my cool. <laughs> I get it. What's that? This wall can be traversed with the pumpkin vine ball ability in order to reach that ledge. I mean, I suppose it could. But. Alright, sure. I'll do it. Wah! Changed my mind. Ooh. Sprint, pulp, metal, basic tape. Fantastic. Come on, come on, you got this! You got this! Uh, they planned this. Um, I'm currently on fire. Uh oh. That was a thing I didn't know could happen. But. But this is where I started! I didn't realize it was trying to get me back up. Earth camouflage, neat. <gasps> the traveling merchant. Hey friend, friends are running into you here. Take a look at my catalog, why don't you? <gasps> Whoa! Berserk cures. Recycled tapes. Yes. Resonance cures? Ooh, that could, that could be handy. Cure-alls. A miracle panacea that claims to cure all afflictions removes all status effects from one party member, including the positive ones. Uses up a turn during combat. Mm. I'm gonna take 
this rare astral camouflage. I'm gonna take uh, three of them, actually. Two of them. 12% chance of... What? What is that? Plus one duration, plus 14% priority chance per empty slot, plus 12% chance of... Some sort of targeting thing. Icicle dart could be useful. I'll grab two of you. I don't need a regular heroic blade, though. Compliment. Lowers the target's range defense, gives more experience per empty slot, increases duration. Excuse me, I think I'm good. Well, who avoid the lack of money in these parts sure makes things difficult. Catch you later. Find the ball. I wonder where he is. Isn't this where we fought the... This is where we fought the boy. Yeah, this is where we fought the Ever of Wah. Hey! Oh, we're holding a fire sale for a limited time only. It's one hundred percent off your health bar. So health bars are canonical. A pyromelian. Oof. Okay, so my only electricity resistance is a weak to fire, so... Hmm. I'm gonna try to defeat the spark tan first, then. Smack! Nice! Guzzle fuel, huh? Wait. Yeah, this will work. Kaylee's fine. We'll nurse Kaylee, and we'll use um, we'll just use air because it extinguishes him. That is what you were at. Localized entirely with a new world. That is what you were asking to see, right? Surefire. Ah, targets with lock characters with locked on can't miss. Interesting. That seems to be a lot better than simply, um... That's a lot... Yes, yay! That seems to be a lot better than the, um, the no evasion thing. Well, actually, not true, because, um... Well, it seems... To, well, obviously, if they already have high evasion, like, if they've boosted their evasion, hitting with the, the sticky spray is difficult. But, um, them having the status effect allows you to hit to sure hit with both of your party members. There are ups and downs either to both ones. I hadn't thought of. I'm gonna smack ya. I'm actually gonna magic tome you. And I'm gonna damage roll ya. Vroom! But you want <sighs> Alright, time for your Oh my god, it's Artillerex! <laughs> Jesus Christ, he's so big! He looks like a fusion! Oh my god! <laughs> well, there goes Matt. Uh, that was. This guy's defense must be. Oh, 930 damage? Why is he asleep? What the heck just happened? None of that made any sense. It's tiny! It's tiny baby! Don't need to fuse if you're already as strong, right? I wonder how big a fusion with Artillerex would be. But, um, it's Tiny Ralph! I love Tiny Ralph. Every time Ralph gets a new move, she shows up super tiny. <laughs> oh, thank you for your custom. Bye, landkeeper. You shouldn't still be here. Hmm. Oh, that's gotta be him. That's gotta be him. He's probably gonna be ice, right? 
So... Shoku and Decibel. Easy choice. Huh. Captain Cody, you came a long way just to see- He's got a VR headset! Fusion with Artillerex equals Godzilla. <laughs> you came a long way just to see me, huh? They call me Cody. Because I used to code. Well, I used to break code. Anything in the information space can be cracked if you're smart enough. Websites, video games, government servers. <laughs> I got in a little trouble over that last one. But here in New World, there's no internet here. What a joke. The only thing here for me to hack are these monster tapes. There's someone pretty good at that too, which is why I'm a ranger captain. Come on! Come on! I bet you're desperate to see my modded cassette tapes. Are you gonna take my ranger captain challenge or what? Sure. All right. Hope you're prepared to go head to head with a combat master. I'm a little worried. You're playing with power. You're playing with power. Go ahead. Oh. That's bad. Glitter and glass? He's a bootleg user. Oh no! A glass apocalypse. That's when it lips. It never gets old. I did get fooled. Nobody else has had the element that they've of the area they've been in. I don't know why I thought this guy would. Okay. Well, in that case, I have no idea what to do. I mean... I do have one idea. I can't use Thunder Blast yet, though. I don't have enough AP. What does that do? Electrify. Spit. No, no, Glitter Bomb! Ah, oh, dang it. Crystal Lens. Oh, no, not Crystal Lens! Now your glass! Hitting a glitter type monster with any type of elemental attack causes the glitter monster to change type to match the attack. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Why did I use charge? I don't want to use charge, I want to use smack. Oh, it was roll again. Whoops. Never judge a book by its cover, even less so judging by judging by the location it's found at. That's a really good point, actually. So you're air now, huh? And I'm glass? Alright. Little Mina! We need to remove that coating so I can make him glass, too. But it doesn't really matter. Um... Just gonna spit. No, he still has glitter bomb. Dang it! And now I'm gonna make all of them glitter. Oh Jesus! <laughs> and he does have an air mood. That's right, he's air now. This is so com. This is so convoluted. This is like the epitome of chaos. I like. This is the most chaotic thing I've ever seen. Oh my god! God, I'd love a glittery a glitter decibel. At least the glitter palette is pretty agreed. God, this is so chaotic. I don't want to fuse either because I don't know, like, I don't know what that's going to do. Like, I'm worried about the potential, about the potential, like, badness of that. It's going to use double in flame, I guess. No, not silica. He is. He is trying to do it. He's trying to make- He is! He's going for my combo! <gasps> That's his whole gimmick! Is that he makes you- He makes you glass! That's why he has a glass friend! He makes you glass so he can resonate you! Oh, that's so evil! That's how you change somebody's ty typing, is using glitter! Oh, this is disgusting. I 
thankfully I have a, I have something that can help with that. You're fire right now, huh? Sploofy, I need you. Sploofy hard counters this guy. Thankfully, I picked these up from the traveling salesman. Actually, wait, no, I think the nurse has these now. Ow. God, stop using Glitter Bomb, I swear! This strategy is so evil. I mean, it's fine when I use it, but it's evil if anybody else tries to use it. Roll! No one still can slash me. Oh, Jesus. There goes your glittery boy. Please stop doing that. No. Yeah! Yes! I don't care what you were about to use. I'm tired of your gimmicks. Although I actually kind of... I am actually kind of curious what he was planning on using. Bot meat kettle, kettle, this is bot, yup. <laughs> I mean, yeah, this is my this is my favorite strategy. I say favorite strategy. It's hard to pull off, and it, I really only like to use it because it's just so cool, right? Like it's an instant kill strategy, and you can kill you can do it in like one turn. Let's switch out to Shoku. gonna spit on the apocalypse. Although I'm pretty sure this just wins with damage. Resonance! Fail. Fail you. God, it's so expensive because it's four. I need to I think I need to get rid of both from the blue, because if it if rolling in hits it, it's just a waste. Thunder blast! And spit. Resonate! Yeah, baby! Ugh. We won! We didn't even have to fuse! Air coating. Really? That's an interesting one. What? What? How did I lose? I mean, I intended to lose. This was just a test for you, after all. And you passed. Congratulations, or whatever. Rainy, rainy. Well, that's the last captain, and I got an olive up too. Glitter bomb. Ooh. Ooh, okay. Okay, now that's useful. I don't get any ideas that you want on purpose here. If I was going all out, you wouldn't stand a chance. Cope and seethe, Cody. Let's see, um... Huh? What am I looking at? Summit? I heard there was some kind of crazy lighthouse at the top. I, I don't know, I don't see a lighthouse. We can't get up that high. Yeah. Guess I'm gonna have to go through here. Uh. 
Alright, no! Ah! I know what he was gonna what he was gonna turn into now. Yeah, sure, since I'll never see it. I'd love to know. Wind boot like or two Rex! No! Oh, I cheated myself. Oh, that stinks. Oh, <laughs> dang. That would have been awesome. Let's see. Bicycle dart! Uh-oh. <gasps> the accuracy got down. I guess technically I don't need to fuse here. Should be fine. Mm. Wolf from the blue should do is like technically 90 power. Let's use Thunder Blast. So it'll also extinguish him. Yeah, Ice Fire is perfect to use Thunder Blast on. Can't use Nurse. We'll just rewind. Oh, no guns! Okay. Please don't raise your ranged attack. Do you know how much damage you just- No! Oh god. Oh god. Oh. <sighs> that was close. Whoa! What is a Capri? Oh, that's so cool! Oh, but I- there's no way I get the Capri. Lofi's dead. I can try. Let me get rid of this awful ice pick. No, 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 no! God, why did that do so much damage to- Why did that do so much damage to her? I'm gonna damage roll the uh, Capri. Uh oh, that gets rid of the wall. Yep. Ah. Uh. Capri is a monster with the highest ranged attack stat in the game. Oh god. <laughs> well, that's not something you ever want to hear. Please don't use no rush. I forgot you still have. Uh, ah! Forgot you still have ice moves. Uh, <laughs> fine, whatever. Haha. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> okay. <laughs> <laughs> sure. Wait, why is it still hurting me? What? It shouldn't have got through the air wall. What? How does that work? Oh no, Capri must have some sort of like APDS or sniper. Ah, clever. See, um, I 
damage roll time. One damage roll won't kill, especially with an 11. Yeah, that's what I thought. All right, your attack is lowered. God, you're so cool. Yeah, that's what I thought. Crumble is like brick break. Uh... Okay. I come back to the rare key. It is rare, rare cat free. Okay. No, 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 no. Spitz. Stop! So the multi hits still make it through my my air wall. All right, range attack is down. Rewind again. Running out of these. Lucky love, thank you, excess. Except, uh, you might want to reserve that, uh, judgment for... Until I'm actually able to beat the- um, until I'm actually able to catch this thing, because I can't- I can't catch it the most excli- oh! Wow, that's a really high chance. I can't catch it the most- okay! Efficient way. Uh oh. V1, so not that lucky yet. Poster tape. Recording! Recording! Oh god, that's not good. That's real bad. Yeah, I just lost. Yeah. Sorry. Whatever. Oh god. <sighs> Are you okay? You had me worried there for a moment. Ah, oh, you're awake. You're lucky I had a friend to get you back to my clinic in one piece. Why don't you take these with you? Oh, <laughs> thank you. Well... If you two are traveling across New Wirral, you'd be wise to stock up on healing supplies before you go. I'll trade you restoratives for any resources you have on hand, and so will Clemence at the Gramophone Cafe. Stay safe out there, Lo-Fi. If you're careful, you won't end up back here anytime soon. Uh, yeah, sure. I was careful enough. I just didn't expect Capri to be that dangerous. Hey, tell me where the other captain is. My favorite radio show is Sybil FM, hosted by Captain Sybil herself out in the marshes. Ah! Found you. It is my first loss, actually. In a lot of those lately. Let's see. Wait, wait, you lost so you can rematch the monsters it was. Static from a chest. Oh! So initially, it's random. So there was no, it wasn't guaranteed that I would find. You're supposed to lose much sooner, judging by- Yeah, judging by the dialogue, yes, I was. <laughs> so, okay, so when I first click the chest, it's random, right? But then if I lose, the chest stays the same? Captain Civil is. No! I saw it right before I hit it. Sharp edges. Custom starter. Did they repair all my tapes? They did. Click. I found a rat carousel there and I ran and I ran and when I came back later it was still the same. <gasps> awesome! Okay, so now I'm prepared for Kefri. Fire and I oh. What oh no actual way. No actual way. Wait. Are we prepared for this? Hey! 
Creator Felix's friend, I've been training. Let me show you just how strong I am. Okay. Cool. I've been wanting to do this for a while. She's still there? Yay! I've been wanting to do this. I've been really hoping there was another opportunity for this. I'm so excited. She didn't leap out of existence as we would assume. I think she did, but then she came back. Well, actually, I mean, she can't go anywhere else but this island, so she kind of just disappeared to train. Revenge strike! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna charge Kaneko, and I'm gonna use Inflame on both of them. Charge! I was actually thinking about I, I was actually wondering I didn't want to ask because I didn't actually want an answer but I was thinking I was wondering if it was possible since you guys called Kaneko a legendary if it was possible for her to show up in place of a rogue fusion I don't know if that's what this is or if it literally is just she shows up here after a little while Broken wall. I want to be really careful. I'm going to use battery, which is going to get uh, lo-fi hurt, but I'm going to record with a chrome tape. I can use an aerosol tape after if, if this isn't enough. Recording! Recording! Uh-oh. Yeah, she's a legendary. That's for sure. Ooh. Ooh. 25%. No, don't hit Kaylee. Sorry. <sighs> All right, no worries. <gasps> okay, I need to get uh, no more. No, <laughs> I can't use can't use Shoku anymore. That was so close. I almost lost her. That was really close. Okay, um, switching is floofy. We're gonna just use a basic tape. Because my roll again, my roll again tried to use broadcast, but it might have tried to use an offensive move. And if that had happened, I would have. Oh! Uh, please don't kill Kaylee. I'm begging you. Sorry. I was about to say, if that one percent chance proc, I would have been. So... I would have laughed at the very least. I don't know. I wouldn't be angry. I'm just glad to have another Kuneko. So what happens if you fuse two of the same, but one of them is remastered and one of them isn't? Is it different than fusing two of the same remastered? You know what? Don't answer that. I'll actually, I'm going to, I'll see after, I'll see after we try this. Uh, she seems to be going exclusively after Kaylee, so I'm going to use, um, I'm going to use, um, lo-fi for this, for this round. Damage roll. Recording. A three. Dang it. We're going aerosol this time. My one aerosol tape, let's do this. No worries, Red. Hope you have a fantastic day. I think we've only got about like a half hour, maybe a little bit more to the stream, but I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. Here's all tape. Recording. A 10's not bad. There's a 29% chance. 
Oh, yeah, that's that's a solution that you could use. Ah! <gasps> oh! You know what? If I had... Oh, uh, this actually would have been doable if I had... Um, I think I need to replace Shining Kaneko with... Um, with uh, Mega Violent. I wanted to use Shining Kaneko, but... Like... I just... Mega Violent has so much capture utility. Just utility in general. She's my defense against poison types. One of them. She's one of my defenses against poison types, which to be fair, I just realized she's also weak to fire. Um, but she's one of my defenses against poison types. And uh, she also can petrify enemies for easy capture. And I just, like, I, 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 Kaneko, both of Kaneko's roles are already on the team, Astral and Wind. So I just, I, I think I'm gonna have to switch her out, sadly. But she'll stay on the team for a little while longer if we can pull this off. Chrome tape. Recording. Recording. Magic tome. That was a lot of damage. Please don't hit Kaylee. No. Sorry. Oh. I really wish there was a way to heal our bodies. We might not be able to do this. An eight? That's nothing. Wink. Oh, well, that's nice. Thank you. <gasps> I got her! Yeah! Yay! <laughs> to Nickel. <laughs> Maybe it's it's too uh, it's maybe it's not obvious. Two Neko. Uh, oh, I won't be defeated so easily, you know. Wait, what? Uh oh, she really she figured out how to harness her power for good. That's good. I'm proud of her. And I don't have any poison on my team right now. Okay, well. That's fine. We use damage roll. Magic Tome! She's much stronger now. A one! No! Oh, man. Uh, I'm going to use Astro Coating on Kaylee and have Kaylee use a rewind on herself on Decibel, on her Decibel tape. Huh? Oh, we have multi-target! Wait, I'm confused. Why does the Astro Coating make my already Astral Sploofy, Sploofy look darker? Roll. We're basically just fighting each other. We're basically just fighting to give each other um, bonuses to AP regen. It's basically just a really high-powered game. I mean, Magic Tome is like my strongest move, so... Magic Tome! A 20! Yeah! Wait, so can I record a Shining Kaneko? Well, too late now. <gasps> Shooting Star! She got it! It's one target. Neat. Yeah. Well, I'll beat you next time! 
<laughs> no worries, Kaneko. You're doing great. You're doing great, girl. Alright. I want to see Super Kaneko. Discuss fond memories of the places you visit. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and just bench Funerain for now. Just a random one. And we're gonna get two Neko out of this out of storage. Didn't realize that was the end of okay, cool. <laughs> Alright, let's add two Neko to the party. I want to see what this looks like. And since we're going to use up a fusion, we might as well, even though we can get our fusions really quickly, we might as well go fight like something big. Except I just realized, no, we shouldn't because my, well, Tuniko and Kuniko are kind of uh, low power right now. So let's just go fight something on like the, in like the basic starting area. Drive a crab, fight me. Fuse! Lo Fi and Kaylee's hearts act as one! That's like kind of awful. <laughs> it's kind of horrible. Shining Neko! Does it change if it's too awfully amazing? Oh my god! Does it change if she's if they're both re remastered? Is it different if they're both remastered? <gasps> What's this? Wow. I must confess, dear Meredith, the way in which you fashioned yourself is unlike any I have seen before in my country and in this one. Um, I'm not sure if that's a compliment or not. No. I mean no insult. You seem unconcerned with aligning yourself with the appearance of those around you. It implies a deeper confidence in oneself. <laughs> I find you rather admirable in that regard, dear Meredith. Uh, yeah. uh thanks, mate. <laughs> cool. Okay, so now we just gotta go find Sybil in the swamp. A lighthearted conversation about your romantic histories. Yep, that's... That's girl talk. Let's see, um... Kuniko is going in storage, so is Shining Kuniko. Sorry, baby. Alright, where is Funerain? Red. We've got Mega Violent. Alright. That's gonna fix our party up real nice. Girl talk or talking about group? I mean. <laughs> why can't it be both? Bonjour. Bonjour. What can I do for you? Bonjour, Clemence. Yeah, sometimes it's both. Yes. We. <laughs> oui. All right, let's go find some. Yay! Oh, I'm so. I just love seeing Sunny. Hey, Lo-Fi. Let's see. All right, let's see if we can track. Uh, let's see if we can track her down, or them down. I don't think we actually got pronouns for Sybil, so uh, we'll see if we can track them down. A rogue fusion in the pumpkin patch. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, dang it! These things are so <laughs> these things are so startling. See you later, board. I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you for stopping by. Hmm. 
Oh, thank you, Borb. You're so sweet. Look at how much fusion bar we get from just a single super effective hit. It's so incredible. Oh, there goes a mask rattle. That's basically just what I wanted was, um, yep, there we go. I just wanted a full fusion bar for when we fought Sybil. The Sybil's probably going to be kind of interesting. Search around inside here a little bit. There you are. No! You're a wannabe. Get out of my way. I want to be Sybil's interview today. But where is Sybil? A sirenade? Interesting. Uh, the poison's a bit of a problem. It is cute. In flame! So wait, Sybil is a interviewee. So is Sybil some kind of change the record? <gasps> you! I remember that move. I thought it was terrible. Uh, super heated fist is too much. We're gonna get smack. Good job. Goodbye, Jellyton. Spit. Oh, well, uh, don't worry. You shall join your Sybil in the afterlife! Just kidding. I'm not gonna uh, kill either. Maybe I'll come back tomorrow instead. Sure, we'll camp here. We'll rest. It's a lot of wood. Hey! You're quieter than usual, Lo-Fi. Is there something on your mind? Oh my god! Wait, it's happening! I thought we had already done that when we kissed! Oh my god! It's happening! I want us to be together. Do it! <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I want us to be together. I, I thought you might. Truth be told, I don't think I saw you in that way until we fused. For a start, I've only ever had a few short relationships, and they were all with boys too. Oh! <gasps> yeah, we did. It was last stream. <laughs> I thought you saw that. It may sound a wee bit silly, but when we fuse, I feel like I feel your soul. And then maybe I know you in a way I don't even know myself. I don't know if I have a word to describe it. I... I... I think you're beautiful. Oh! 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 God! Oh my god, that's so cute! It was at the end of the stream. It was at the end of last stream. Yeah. Mm hmm mm hmm <clears throat> You should check out the VOD. Of course I want to be with you. Oh, and even if one day we have to part, it'll have been worth it, I think. I think so, too. <laughs> well, you have a girlfriend now, and she's a budding musician. Aren't you lucky? We should celebrate. <laughs> Enter a romantic relationship. <laughs> oh, I love it. And I think, didn't you think you missed it? No worries. Mm. 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 All right. <laughs> yeah, I have a girlfriend now. 
All right, so we just add to the list. <laughs> no, 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 that's horrible. That's horrible. All right, so of all the characters I've romanced in games, I think it is. I think we have... Um... It's just Luna, Shadowheart, and Kaylee now, right? <laughs> Yay! We have a girlfriend! Now, where is... Where is Sybil? That's not Sybil. Is it? Hey, hey! It is! Hey, hey! You're listening to Sybil Radio 24-7 coverage across all of New World. You can be Paul. I, yeah, I could. Hey, hey! You're listening. Wait. Freedom! Lofield. We're live from the West Coast with our new trainee, Ranger Lofi. <laughs> the talk behind closed doors is Lofi is a talented fighter in the ways of monstrous combat. What do you say, newbie? Shall we free treat our dear listeners to an oral battlefield experience? Sure. Yeah, I'll battle Sybil. Oh, yeah! Fasten your proverbial seatbelts, listeners. Here's an exclusive live performance. Sorry, you're no regulars, but you are still pretty cool. Meow. Oh! We live! Oh, I love Sybil. I'm gonna go mega violent with uh, Lo-Fi and Ralph with uh, Kaylee. They awesome. They are pretty awesome. Ah, not shrapnel. Change the record! Oh, I'm glad you. No, it hits both members. Oh no! They use a roar. No. They use a Spike's Roar Team? That's evil! That's actually evil! Oh my god! And now we're both weak to Sybil. Oh, that was like the worst- that was the worst roll we could have gotten on Change the Record. Um... I need to be a different team. Don't do it again. Don't you dare. Smack. Why do you have multi-target? Stop! Stop! That's so not fair! It's like they're getting to pick which ones they switch us out to. Hmm. You know what, then? Lo-Fi and Kaylee's hearts act as one! Foundkyrie. Oh no. That uh, that's got like that's got like a weird energy to it. Let's use the fusion power. Get him, my face. I'm team shards! Wow! That oh no, oh yeah. Yeah! The battle's heating up! Will your beloved host prevail or will victory go to a plucky underdog? Time for the crescendo! Oh. Guess a sirenade? Hmm. Okay. He's down. Let's go ahead and use spit then. Um, yeah. No, not spit. We'll use double boil. I only have three. Yeah, we'll use spit. Because that'll hit them both twice. Spit. From my sword? Which will now follow our allow artistic nudity following the viral... <laughs> Wait, is that real? I just realized that doesn't really make sense with what that doesn't really fit any it is. 
Huh. Okay. That seems like a bit of a slippery slope. Um, but sure, why not? Oh my god, it's only three? Yeah, wow, that's... Face down! We won! Yeah, I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. Wow. Wow, what a performance. Our listeners loved it. Here's your payment, of course. Sticker. Yay! I did it! I got broadcast, fuse material, and upgrade broadcast. Makes sense. I used to be a real rising star on radio. It's not been the same since I ended up here. I'm sticking with it, though. Every day I broadcast across New World and hope that someday, somehow, someone from beyond this island will receive the signal. And maybe then they'll come and rescue us all. Wow. Enough melancholy! You did fantastic in our battle! I see a promising future ahead of you! Me with Ranger Leader I to let her know you've trained with all the Ranger Captains. Wow! Yeah, we're done! We did it! Now we get to take on, like, super challenges. And we get to take on, like, our daily quests. <laughs> Vine ball! I love the vine ball so much. Oh no! <laughs> Poor Sybil fan. Alright. Um, the Gramophone Cafe? <laughs> Who knew that being in a relationship would involve so many coffee breaks? <laughs> I love her. Almost. Almost. Well, guess what? Access me and Kaylee are kind of a thing now. We're dating. One person gonna want to meet you before really. You mean Ayanta? If I knew that people would be calling me Cody forever, I would have picked a cooler nickname like Kill Switch or Omega Bite. I mean, you can just pick your own name. I did. Wait, Wait your name wasn't always Ayanta? Nope. Nope. In my former line of work, it was safe to pick an alias. I'm sure you can relate. Ayanta is the name of a water goddess in Greek mythology. I needed to choose a name in a pinch and I thought it sounded good. Huh. huh. You sure do have a lot of secrets of your own, don't you? <laughs> don't expect me to tell you any more than that. Am I gonna have to fight Ayanta? I guess I could. It makes sense. Hello. Hello, sweetie. Hi, hi Regulus. Time to talk to the her. All right, all right, all right. We'll talk to the her. Ta ta. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'll talk to her. Are you getting so excited? Hey, hey Lofi, something on your mind? Um, training with the captains. You have a completed stamp card to show me, perhaps. Here it is. <laughs> so the chatter was correct. You haven't been here long, but you've already shown a real knack for traversing the island and overcoming any obstacles. Congratulations. Congratulations, Lofi. You're officially a ranger. Wow! Brilliant. Brilliant. You've earned this, Lofi. I'm afraid we don't have any special ceremonies to mark the occasion. We're too busy training new recruits so that we can deal with those rogue fusions. Well, you know, we could use more people like you helping with the training. Have you ever thought about becoming a captain? I can't say that I have, but... Should I? Maybe? I feel like Lo-Fi might. I have. If you're interested, there's one final challenge. You have to defeat me in combat. Hey, Sayanta, and one final challenge to become a captain yourself. Well, well, what do you say? Do you want to take on the trial to become a ranger captain? <laughs> sure. Right. I've been itching to see what you're really made of. I hope you're prepared to give us your all. Us. Well, I think it'd only be reasonable that my wife gets to help me out on this one. You're married? I, I, I have a girlfriend. <laughs> you're married? Hi. Are you ready, honey? Oh my god! <laughs> what? Oh my god! Practice of the century! Oh my god! Biggest plot twist in gaming! Biggest plot twist in video game history! I can't believe it! Oh my god! Oh my god! I don't care what the end of this game does, it will not compare to what just happened right here! Oh my god! Uh, oh my god, so not only- Oh my god, well it seems twofold! 
It's twofold! Because I didn't expect- Oh my god! I had no idea that they were married, but also, I didn't think I was going to fight Wilma! Wilma and Ayanta. Oh, I love it! I love them! God, they're so cute! <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Okay. Okay, now that I've clipped my- I've peaked my mic like a zillion times and that entire section is completely inaudible, I'm sure. Unintelligible. Um, um, I think I'm ready. I think I'm good. <laughs> I think I'm ready to fight Wilma and Ayantha. Yeah! Whoa! Why? What was the- Oh, it looked like a snake. This is really shaping up to the hardest fight of the year! Who will come out on top? You got this one, Lo-Fi! Come on, off worlders, show Ayanta who's boss! Kick him butt, Ayanta! Don't hold back! <laughs> I love Cleo. Is this a special? Nah. Head Ranger, don't think we're gonna pull any punches, Lo-Fi. You're not a trainee anymore. You're in the big leagues now. Oh my god, I love that she has a custom, like, idol animation. Like, Wilma stands like everybody else, but she's just, like, so cool. <laughs> You're in the big leagues now. I wonder if there's something with her wrong with her right hand. Good luck. Nope. Guess not. Um. Right. This thing. Oh no. I thought that was a. I thought she would. I forgot she used this thing. Level sixty. Oh, we're gonna die. Jin was a challenge. Yeah, I imagine it would be. Oh, Lex! I didn't notice. Okay. The metal's a problem. Hmm. Face down. Let's try Mega Violent. In flame! Moonshine. Ha! <laughs> Clever. <laughs> I like it. Confused. Spit. What are you prepping for, Ayanta? Sticky spray. Who's the biggest trouble? Oh no, they have two extra tapes. Okay, um... This might be difficult. I'm gonna petrify Wilma. Sticky spray! That's fine. Gin intoxicates! A lot of damage. Oh, jeez. Confusing me. She's confusing me all over the place. Okay. Radiation breath! There goes- oh, never mind. I'm not gonna be petrifying Wilma. I guess we're going spoofy. You know what? I know what's gonna happen. If they, I bet you if they both get to their last tape, they're going to fuse. Oh, no. Because Ayantha was the only, uh, when we first learned about fusing, they talked about how Ayantha was like the only person she'd ever seen fuse before. Oh, no. Uh, it also might just happen if we fuse. It, uh, it also might might be that if we fuse, they fuse. Which might actually not be a bad thing, now that I think about it. Because, hmm. No, it would be, because then I'd have to- I'd, I'd still have to beat them after they fuse. Oh, jeez. Um, hmm. Metal's a big deal. Face down. I'm gonna melt. I'm going to magic tell my Antha, and then we're gonna use uh, inflame again. Ba -bam! Oh 
God, I do not like to intoxicate. I've been really lucky on the Confuse pro on, with Confuse. <gasps> Whoa! Is that what Cloxley turns into? Oh, wow! I kind of now, okay. I really like that. <laughs> Yeah. Baby and start of Evo. Wow. I'm going to fuse. This might be a bad idea, but I think I'm going to do it. Lo fi and Kaylee's hearts act as one. Ram Bell. Our signature fusion! Damage roll! Spring load. Uh oh. Oh, I. Three. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, spring load is a counter move, right? Oh! Suction cup dart. I'd like to try to beat, um,. I'd like to try to beat Wilm, uh, beat uh, Gin and Tonic, Gin and Tonic before I beat Ayantha. Yeah. Excuse me. Manly becomes ranged. Oh yeah, I remember that now. What a weird ability. Let's use damage roll. A four. Oh man, I'm paying for all those high rolls from earlier in the game. Compliments. Well, where's my range defense? Uh oh. Well, at least I want this burned. Uh oh, I got confused. I use peekaboo. Oh, confused just means I use a random move, huh? Interesting. Ha <laughs> ha. You missed. Uh oh. Well, Sonic Boom's not bad. Whoa! I forgot how strong Sonic Boom is. It's so like, it's very weird. Let's use Sonic Boom. Boom! Sorry, Ayantha. What? Oh! She uses it! <gasps> Decibel! No! Sorry, Wilma. Love you. Yeah, Wilma's tricky. I can't believe Ayantha and Wilma are married. I- I'm at- I- look like- like- and I'm so happy. I'm so happy that I aunt that when we were married. I'm gonna use magic tome. Uh oh, he's astro coding. Oops. Oh my god. Uh oh, yeah, metal riff was a problem. Magic tome. Flump. Oh, that did way less than I thought it did. Fusion Bear! It's the Celestial Meteor! Pfft. Heck of a way to end it! Impressive. Impressive. The only thing I would have changed about that is to have her not collapse like everybody else does when she loses. Headshot! Cool! Fuse material upgrade. Oh my god, I did it! We beat Ayanta and Wilma! Wait. 
Not bad. Thank you, thank you! Defeat Ayanta and become a ranger captain. Not bad, not bad at all. You never fail to impress, do you? The stories were true. What a battle! Here, this is yours. It's a bottle cap! Yeah! <laughs> patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winner. This means you're officially a ranger. I should have said patrolling patrolling cassette beast world makes you almost makes you wish for a nuclear winner. This means you're officially a ranger captain. Folks will look to you to help train them just like the other captains trained you. You might be aware that I was the first person in New World to have transformed into a monster form with a cassette tape. Since then, folks have been asking me the same question. Uh -huh. How does this cassette tape thing even work? It doesn't make any sense. You want to know what I think? I think it makes perfect sense with the right perspective. Humans create art, such as music. Art is an intangible and imaginary thing that exists entirely within our collective imagination. But yes, thank you! Thank you! Let me do one more applause, because that was quite wild. Thank you! Thank you! Then we seal that intangible music in physical, physical forms, such the such the cassette tape. That makes it a perfect bridge between the physical world and the imaginary one. <laughs> I think that makes sense in a way. I do too! You see the notice board outside the town hall, right? If there are any trainees who need to test their skills, I'll leave you a message there. <sighs> For now, I'm going to take a long overdue rest. If you're going to continue your exploration across the island, why don't you catch up with your fellow captains? I'm sure they'd like to congratulate you on your promotion. <laughs> Yay! Now I can catch up with each of the ranger captains, which I imagine just means they're going to try to fight me again with their full power. But maybe not. Oh my god, I can't believe we did it. Fuse material to next level. What? Uh, Notice to all rangers. Don't forget to question townsfolk for rumors or you may miss something. Ayanta doesn't have the time to follow up on every bit of hearsay herself. Okay. <clears throat> Wait a minute. Training? This is just like side quests. The squirey population in the Oscars has been getting rowdy lately. Defeat five of them in combat to calm them down and keep them from seriously hurting each other. One of the local residents lost a ring in Easton Woods. It has high sentimental value, so please do your best to locate it and return it to his owner on the lake. Ranger supplies have been going missing lately. One of our scouts reported witnessing the thief at work. The individual has been tracked to a location in the caves in Cherry Meadow. Confront him and find out what's happened to our goods. Okay. Post-game quest in between post-game quests! So what can you tell me? I want your full analysis. Very well. Very well. Our rogue fusion problem has indeed been increasing in recent months. Have you seen the dense black clouds in the air recently? I've concluded that these indicate where monsters are swarming. <laughs> On a recent recon mission, I found myself in the midst of a swarm of gelatins. They may have had superior numbers, but I cut them all down the same! I uh, cut them down all the same! However, I fear that our more inexperienced rangers may underestimate these threats and find themselves in mortal peril. Perhaps we should get the word out these, about these monster swarms. Right. Consider it done. Your intel is as valuable as always, Gladiola. You're too kind. You're too kind. No, you, if you'll excuse me, I have more work to do. The forces of darkness take no breaks, so neither shall I! I like Gladiola. Hey, Hello, Wilma. Sweetie. Hello, sweetie. Now you're a full-time ranger. I can let you have some really special items. Take a look. <gasps> Whoa! What is this? Optical laser tape. Uses futuristic laser-based technology to store monster forms efficiently. <laughs> Guarantees a successful recording for 50 shards! Are you kidding me? What's a ritual candle? A curious item Captain Skip discovered in one of their latest hauls. They say, burn this candle and then sacrifice recycle a recorded tape to influence the next fusion you encounter. It will have a chance to contain a bootleg that matches either the type or the species of the tape you sacrificed. Oh, okay. The bootleg candle. <laughs> it's a bootleg candle. Can devil tape. A tape of a oh, a tape of a very rare monster we save for rangers who know we know can handle it. And band sheep tape. A tape of a very rare monster we save for rangers we know can handle it. So I can get band sheep's other form. Well, that's fun. And I can get can devil. Can devil at all. And it works on legendary? I got a metal glycy Jesus. That's actually pretty cool. 
Okay, well that was... Let's just do one last... Um... Oh, I don't have much metal left. That's fine. Pollution sticker pack. Rare Shield Bash. It's a target. It uses the main, user's melee defense instead of melee attack. Plus three ranged attack. What? Oh, interesting. Makes the target conductive. Hits one target multiple times. Bottle volley. <laughs> Cute. Hits one target multiple times. One to three. I mean, that's between 40 and 120 power. So that's pretty solid. Um, Yeah, waterproof. Neat. I've been thinking about getting some proof stickers for my... um. For maybe Sploofy, like trying to get like poison proof or something. Hey. Hey, Lofi, I have something on your mind. What is fused material? No, sorry, just saying hi. Oh, you can't ask her about the about like types and stuff anymore. I love the movement text in this game. I love that there are movement texts in this game. Come on. Dang it. Okay. I'll just go up this way then. <laughs> God, like the vine ball, the vine ball and the and the fly flight abilities make the game so much more interesting to just navigate around. <gasps> Flirt! Oh, it's one of these thirty plus thirty percent chance of sure shot. Neat. Well, you know what? I think that is a fantastic place to leave it for today. Um. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be great. Um, uh, we're going to go ahead. And I guess next week we will continue. We will probably be finishing the game. Yeah, finale, I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Um, yeah, I'm assuming next time it's going to be the end, which I am actually. Excuse me. Actually very excited about. I'm really wanting to see at least for the main story. Of course, of course, of course. Yeah. I'm really clear, curious to see how it goes. But yeah, thank you everybody for coming. Um, Real quick, tomorrow is Citizen Sleeper. It's going to be great. This might be the end of Citizen Sleeper as well, but I can't say that for sure. Tomorrow might be the last Citizen Sleeper stream, but I don't know. Um, The game seems to have a lot left to it, and we have we have like one whole DLC we haven't even done yet, so... Well, sorry, that we haven't even seen yet. We're in the middle of the second one, and we have one, one, one after that that we have to do, so who knows how long, the, how long, whether or not we'll actually finish the game. I mean, you play so long as, yeah, exactly. I play so long as I enjoy it. It's just a great game. I just thought I'd let you guys know, because it's been something I was thinking about, so. Yeah, I mean, I really do enjoy Citizen Sleeper. It's a really amazing game. Highly recommend it. If you haven't, if any of you guys haven't checked it out before, I highly recommend checking out Citizen Sleeper. So yeah, that's tomorrow. Uh, real quick, anybody who doesn't know, maybe in the Phantom audience, I have a Discord server. I just posted a link to in the chat. In the chat. Um, <clears throat> it's a wonderful place where you can get access to my schedule, as well as times when I go live and hang out with me and other low fans. So uh, it's a super great place. Highly recommend it. Check it out. Whoa. Oh, because you can use the keyboard. Oops. I highly recommend checking it out. It's super fun. We have lots of we have lots of great times there. Just post the VOD channel as well, just in case anybody's curious. And um, yeah, thank you for stopping by. Um, I hope you guys had lots of fun, because I did, and the fun's not stopping here. We're gonna have a ton of fun all week and all the way up till Christmas, baby. <laughs> so thank you everybody for I love each and every one of you, and I hope you all have an absolutely spectacular, wonderful, terrific, amaze, amazing rest of your day. And I'll see all of you guys tomorrow. Bye.